you do. You do. And the drop top rock with you, I feel like Scarface. <laughs> and the white bitch with the bomb, I'll be your main one. Let's take this <laughs> argument back up to my place. <laughs> We're in a loving mood today. <laughs> yeah. 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 Smash and grab shit, yeah. 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 That's the how they say the home of you not here. It ain't a home of you not here. Okay. Yeah. 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 I can't lose yeah. when I'm yeah. with you. How can I snooze and miss a moment? You're just too important. Nobody, nobody like you do. I can't lose when I'm with you. Uh, uh, it's, it's, Baby, I won't waste your, your time. time. I won't waste your time, time when it comes to you. you. That shit go crazy. Yeah. When it comes to you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that shit go crazy. You know what I'm so, saying? But big oranges in the chat. Big oranges in the chat one time. Big oranges in the chat. You know what I mean? We are live right now. Back on Fig. You know what I mean? We back Friday. Let's get it one time. You but feel me? the first Friday of the year, though, ain't it? First Friday, Friday of the year. First Friday of the year. First Friday of the year. Yeah. Friday on, of the year. Sure. Yeah. You know what I mean? So what you got for us? You know what I mean? It's your boy Smack, man. It's Friday, man. We finna turn up for y'all. We got the host, T motherfucking Rail, in the building. We got my sis, Heather, Strawberry Daiquiri, well, Hurricane, whatever y'all want to call her. <laughs> we got her in the building. Y'all hey, know me, the co-host hey. Smacky. Let's get to that. In Let's the get to that. Yeah, man, we been in here, man. Let's get to that. We gonna get to my boy Smack too, man. He got some shit to uncover. We gonna two get to that. Details. You know what I'm saying? Two for the details. We gonna get to that, man. So y'all come on up in this motherfucker, man. I don't know who all up in here. Go get your homies. Tell them to come. We started. <laughs> it's gonna go crazy. Hey, but before we start, though, man, I want to give a big shout out to my boy Roy. You know what I mean? Shout out to my boy Roy. You know what I'm saying? Pebbles told me to shout you out, man, because she said, you know what? My brother be watching. You know what I mean? Yeah, My brother real. be watching, man. But shout out Peaches, man. She went and got she went and got our homegirl Pebbles. She was like, back on fig, them your homies. Da -da 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 -da. You feel me? But she in jail. I think she, you know what I'm saying? She serving some life sentences or whatever the case may be. People still keeping a smile on their face. Her brother out here on the streets, you know what I'm saying? He a big fan. But shout out Pebbles. But shout out my boy Roy. Roy, you yeah, feel me? Roy, shout out Pebbles. my boy. Shout out my boy Roy, man. He out there, man. Who would have knew your sister from the pen? Right. <laughs> What's going to connect you to us. Right. The pen, the pen be moving. For sure. Don't mess with the pen. And it fucked him up. He was like, I can't believe this. I got back on fig on the phone right now. Like, I watch y'all. <laughs> I watch y'all. She said, what time you going live? He said, four. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Shout out to him, yeah. shout out to his sister, shout out Peaches. Yeah, man, you feel me? Shout out Peaches, man. That's they're my Hispanic partners, by the by the way. Don't worry about nothing. You know what I mean? They still they connecting, you know what I'm saying? In the pen too, you feel me? Black and brown, man. Put them up, black and brown, man. They still connecting in the pen. Still doing it up for my boy Roy out here, man. You feel me? Tap in with my boy Roy. But yeah, man, back on feet. We here on Friday, man. It's lovely Friday. Y'all stay with us today, man. We're going to be doing some giveaways, man. We're going to be doing some giveaway. I got some stuff in the back. I'm going to be giving away. I got some uh, Mr. Mushies in the refrigerator back there. I'm going to be giving away. So y'all stay tuned okay. with us, man. Y'all stay Sitting tuned ice, with us. Man. Yeah, y'all stay tuned with us for the whole show, man. So y'all can know what's going on, man. We got a, a gang of stuff in those boxes. T-shirts, house shoes. You feel me? I still got some stuff from Delta Munchies. Don't worry about nothing. You know what I mean? Uh, next week, I'm going to have some Imperial stuff to give away. So, yeah, you know what I'm saying? And why are we talking about Imperial? You feel me? Let's do it up with Imperial, man. You feel me? Shout Let's, out to Imperial. Shout out Imperial, man. You feel me? Make sure y'all hit that QR code one time, man, and get it going, man. You feel me? Let me do the ad read. Shout out to Imperial Extractions. This brand has over 16 years in the game. They are dope because it's legal cannabis shipped straight to your door. It's legal in all 50 states. And right now, they are giving away a free 2-gram THC diamond-infused pre-roll with any order. Each pre-roll comes with 1.5 grams of top-shelf flour, 0.5 grams of pure THC, 
UFC diamonds and a reusable glass tip for the luxury smoke we all love. Make sure y'all check out Imperial Extractions. You know, use our code. Uh, tap that QR code at the end of the link and get yours today. And I mean, I can send this to y'all too, man. I got a handful right here, man. I got a handful. Give me one of those Imperials. Yeah, and I mean, I got a handful for y'all. To, I used to, to stay on away. Imperial. This is an empty one. <laughs> Here you go. I used to stay on Imperial. Oh, damn, that was an empty one? Yeah. That's crazy. Damn. Because you be okay. coming in here when we ain't streaming, lighting these motherfuckers up and putting the ball in the air. That's me. me. <laughs> <laughs> this is my smoke room when it's not in use. This is my smoke room. Get away from the kids. Come down here and blow your little ganja, little reefer. Exactly. I'm like, hey, hold on. This ain't no smoke room. <laughs> I come in here yeah. and it's all smoked. I'm like, uh-uh. I'm trying to do it up. This mother got to smell like Fabuloso. <laughs> yeah, he's like, I'm tired of coming down here. My room smells like smoke. I'm like, well, you want me to freeze my ass in the garage and man. sit in the garage and smoke? Fine. Yep. We all Fabuloso in here, man. I love the smell of Fabuloso, man. Me Open too. the window if you're going to do that, man. But yeah, shout out to Mr. Mushy too man you feel me go go ahead and do that we got definitely still got our um orange dream sickle collab on the side shout out mr mushies yeah make sure you go man. to the instagram too man make sure you go to instagram i want to do another of them videos like we did that shit was hard i told him i wanted to do I another do one another of them one. uh the family yeah, man yeah, that shit with the article shit we we said we was gonna do uh damn should i tell him no wait i shouldn't huh mm -mm. damn just let him see it. Because I just was watching it. that shit last night with my wife. Like, look at this shit. This shit was funny, yo. Just, just let him see it. All right, I'm going to just, yeah, because that shit was tight. I, well, at least with the Family Matters, we need at least two more episodes. Yeah. Because that oh. shit was funny. I said, let's do at least two more episodes, and then we we could do something else, too. But we definitely got to keep that going, because everybody loved that. They really? loved it. They loved they it. They did. They loved it. And it just showcases how much talent we have, because we're whole actors out here. <laughs> <laughs> we are. I definitely changed into two motherfuckers. I'm Cat Williams for sure. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, you know I, mean? I, like, I like how we did it because like we didn't do that many takes of that shit. I'm talking about like it was only one or two takes and then, uh, perfect. Yeah. Dynamite. <laughs> yeah, dynamite, guys. <laughs> Shout out to uh, the camera guys, Trevor and Kelvin, because they make it easy process too, and they kind of like know that it's good, and they're like, well, y'all don't need to do this three, four, five times. Y'all got it within the one and two tries. Let's keep it moving. This nigga smack said, "What's my lines? What's my lines?" <laughs> like, we ain't got no lines. <laughs> I thought we had some lines. I thought it was gonna be a real movie. Yeah. We gonna do it. Put my nigga some lines in there. You know what I'm saying? Hey, no, but we just smile. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's your line. Just smile, bitch. Say something. No, you said something in the kitchen, though. You said something in the kitchen. He oh, did. I did. Yeah, hey, if y'all, he's like, let her do it. Why are you keep messing with her? Let her do it. Oh yeah, in the kitchen. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah. Like, what you doing, bro? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh, God, you killed that. Remember. You killed that. Oh, if y'all really want to see this act too. Uh, I, I made that live from our uh, live show when it was on, on the screen what we played on the screen remember we acted that out mm -hmm. live Yeah. so mm -hmm. I made that back if you want to go see it I don't, a lot of you niggas ain't gonna don't be watching you feel me so but if you want to go down our live uh, playlist you can go down there and see uh, me and um uh, Smack reenacting that shit. The, what was on our live screen when we did the live shows and shit like that. So go watch that shit. It's it's it's, it's a few minutes, but it's still funny as fuck. Cause I we was watch in here, it. we was in here really trying to act and really trying to do it up in here, man. You feel me? No, but, we are low key real actors. <laughs> Even like the one that me and you just did, the Hidden Hills just posted. Like that's the, hard when y'all ran in there with the woo wops yeah. and shit with the slippers on. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> What was it? Uh, like Mr. and Miss Smith? Yeah. We kind of really actually did that. And we weren't even there for that many hours. Probably like four or five hours. Not even nothing. Yeah. And we really did that. We really did a good job. And I like Mr. Mushies and Hidden Hills because they're trying to promote their drugs. At the end of the day, it's drugs. They're just they not, it's, at the end of the day, it's not drugs. It's things that, you know what I'm saying? It's recreational well, things that make you feel good. Okay. And you win here, you feel me? Make sure you use our code, F-I-G-G. Don't worry about nothing. Instead of like, oh, we're just going to do regular, like, oh, puff this or that. We're getting real creative to try to promote and, like, do different things. You know, to see us in a different light. Because they also have merch and clothes and slippers and all kind of stuff that they want to promote, too. So, I just think that it's cool. Rather than just hitting a pin or taking a, a edible, like... Like it's like really. Somebody said we acting like actors. creative. <laughs> yeah, we is acting like actors, but nah. we doing it. 
We doing it though. We doing it. We doing it, man. But shout out back on Fig, man. Shout out to everybody that's in here right now, man. Make sure y'all like the video. Y'all already know the routine. Right. Y'all already know the routine, man. Make sure y'all like the video. If you're not subscribed to the channel, make sure you subscribe to the channel, man. You feel me? Does anybody and, need to film? Yeah. 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 Right. And if you um it, we definitely dropped a uh uh, uh, something on YouTube. We had some of our best moments. I don't even. It wasn't even really our best moments. But it was I would more. Say it was more. It was more. It was just like some key moments, but it was stuff that you know, like we just put together and shit, and just you know, reflect on for two thousand three. We poured our heart out to y'all. Y'all seen niggas cry, had to cry. I cried. You really only want to act like he too hard for TV <laughs> and shit. We <laughs> ain't cried a week, cause. We let our emotions out. Marks. You know what I, mean? I don't know if y'all seen that shit, but y'all need to go see it. But I'm gonna play a little bit for y'all though, but because it was just it, the, the, the memories, hey, is, it, it was too tight. For I it, love that video because you do have to remember a lot can happen in a year, and a lot you know you forget about shit and forget how you felt at certain times mm -hmm. within the year. So just to have that recap, just like damn, right. with that did happen. Damn, I went through that. I got over that. Damn, you know it's just good to see and replay. I really enjoyed it. Make sure y'all check out that vlog. It's two hours long, but it's nah, worth it's, not two it's hours. worth the watch. It's one hour and thirty seven minutes. She loves putting extra minutes on shit. I'm extra. But yeah, even when it's the clock, I don't like motherfuckers that do that with the time too. <laughs> what time is it? Like if it's two thirty, <laughs> like, nigga, like it's three o'clock. When I look at my shit and it say two thirty five, I'm like, nigga, it's two thirty five. Right, right. I need my motherfucking twenty five minutes. Right. Right. Like, like I need those twenty five minutes. That should remind me of work. Right. You feel me? Like when well, you gotta yeah. get up at four o'clock. And that motherfucker, or you wake up before the alarm go off, nigga, and it's 350. Like, I need them 10 minutes. Yeah, for sure. I need my two minutes. All right. Oh, everything, but you don't know, nigga. Shut up. You ain't I never do had a know. job. I had a job, nigga, when I was taking them girls' fig. I had a job, nigga. I had to be up on time, <laughs> nigga, to get out there for yeah. work hour traffic. Let's see what's going on. <laughs> Where? clip right there was fuck the guest fuck the guest not saying fuck the guy i love y'all to death but just that clip right there is so crazy homie it's so much emotion in here it's so raw though it's just tight yeah. though you feel yeah. me like for sure and it, it smack asked me like damn looking at that what did you ask me looking at what you know what i'm saying when we was fighting what you think about that now now that this over that happened I argue it. yeah like do you feel it was tea do you feel like <laughs> How you feel about it, man? Now that we can look back and laugh at this shit. Man, I would not change that for the world. Homie. Fair to say. <laughs> I would not change that. That's just me. Mm -hmm. It's just it's real. Just, it's just like, oh, I want yeah. to choke you out. <laughs> <laughs> I just posted that video the other day at Tag. I said, y'all was finna beat the real ass. <laughs> I had to say it before you do, because you was saying some shit like that. I would never in my life do that shit again. Yeah, it was. I would no, never. But that's I was a never of both do of us. Though I would never do that again. Cause now I look at it like you a bitch, man. You over here sitting pouting this day. Yeah. Hey, I got the fan of you doing this. <laughs> no, I would never do that again, homie. But it is like it's just all learning lessons and the shit you can go through. You feel me? Like I wouldn't change that. I wouldn't change that for the world. Even though I knew I, I knew I wasn't gonna do nothing. But I just wanted to. I knew he was live, but I just was like, <laughs> that's why I just had to get up and just release the, the anger, you feel me? But that's why I can't really harp on motherfuckers in here and go crazy on everybody. I could try to tell you a little bit because I already went through the experience right in front of you. Right. So I yeah. learned from it right there. Like, mm -hmm. boom. All right. So 
I hope y'all don't make the same mistake I just made. Right. That's just, you know what I mean? Like, so that's why I was always, you know, and they really, I pressed the line sometimes. They really thought that there was that, uh, uh, we acting or something. Like, that was real life. A lot of motherfuckers did reactions on that. So, oh, it was like, no, that was real fucking life right there, bro. Yeah, if you, you did a reaction, tell. if you would have came in here and you wasn't one of us, you would have got your ass whooped. <laughs> oh, he didn't have to watch the whole clip because it I went all swung. the way out the door to the fucking hallway, to the closet, to oh, God. come into the tree. It was wild. <laughs> <laughs> nah, somebody said change the title. No, nah, ain't changing the title because we ain't got to that yet. So right. y'all sit tight. You feel me? Don't sit tight. But this is one right here. You feel me? That really, that that uh, that really got it too, homie. When you was sitting right here, you was a bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Bruh, I I really was feeling the like, You is a bitch. How? Cause that's like, right. bruh, that shit was bullet. You need to shake it to everybody here. You need to shake my hand. I, I, I was like you. I, I boiled up and I had to just let it out, loved one. You feel me? I ain't ashamed. I was hot, nigga. And then, but you know that that's what got us close, though. You know that this episode, that episode got us close. Yeah. I swear to God, cause Father's Day ended up coming up a few yeah. days after that, and I seen him at the uh, motorcycle Father Day picnic, and I, I walked up to him and started chopping. It up and we've been tight every back back since then. He come pull so up. So that got That's you good. and your father tight. Yes, we've been cool like this. He called me every day. He had to tell me you need a ride to the clubhouse or I see him up there at the meeting. You need me to take you home. What you need? He called me every day and pull up on me. Facts. That's good because just just like seeing a grown ass man cry. He know what he did. Yeah, but yeah. I forgive. We all, I forgive, but I don't forgive. But you know that's back then though. But you oh, forgive. We, we rocking now though. Yeah, yeah you sure. love that. I love that nigga. This oh, my God. dad right here. I called you oh, on God. Facetime. Like, this is my daddy right here. He with his wife. Oh God. He's so good. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I make sure everybody in the bike seat. You know, you know your daddy, daddy back, boy. Yeah, you know this my daddy. He tell everybody. <laughs> you know that's my son right there on the real. He got your daddy back, man. Shout out my daddy. Love you, daddy. And just uh, me watching this clip. I really felt for you there and I really loved you and the last episode didn't really show my love for you it was like a hard love you know and I was being kind of hard on you the last episode and I really don't I really don't feel like that about you because I really love you it's kind of just like big sister little sis, little brother vibes and mm -hmm. I just want you to be the best that you can be in life be the most that you can be really like because you are that already you know and right, just like right. show these niggas you know that it's it's boss time and I kind of went a little hard on you on the last episode so I just want to apologize for that but you know but you gotta remember we're gonna have ups and downs like, like a roller coaster it's gonna have good I'm days like, and this like bad days me and smack right here but watching that I'm like day, that's me and smack you still my sister you feel me at the end of the day it, we're not gonna be happy every episode we on this motherfucker we're gonna have a disagreement and all that me to rail you yeah. we ain't gonna always be perfect you feel me just know I love you before any of this shit when the cameras go off we still gonna be here rocking with each other like yeah. we ain't never left so were I you a little you. mad at me after that episode no nah, I wasn't mad I was glad I got to just get it off my chest to keep it real yeah. though like let me just tell you I feel like you shit on me every time like god damn like what are we supposed to be in this together <laughs> like that's that's yeah. all I was saying now, the higher ups yeah <laughs> the higher ups like and when I got it off, I wasn't mad or nothing. I just, it was over with. I, I, once I, once it's over with, it's over with. Just like that incident with me and Terrell. Once it was over with, it was over with. We talked yeah. about it, and we was back like nothing never happened. Because I really didn't want you to be mad at me because I was trying to come from a good space. Like, I wasn't really trying to come from a hater space or talking down on you space. I was really trying to come up a big you up space and, like, be a boss space. That's all I was coming from. So it did kind of sound... Because everybody was on my head. I noticed it. Everybody was on my head after that. They didn't, well, they didn't like that episode of... And so I kind of had to step back, you know, and look and rewatch it. And then when I watch this, I'm like, I really love Smack. Like, this is our relationship. This is me and you. Like, when I hugged you, I feel for you. Like, you know, right. and I still feel that way about you. And I just kind of went hard on you on the last episode. So I just want to apologize publicly. Nah, you good. I love you, sis. Even though we no. are, you know, I love you, too. I love, I love you, too. Yeah. But when you came over on Monday, I'm like, oh, Smack's going to be upset with me. Woo! He's nah. going to be upset. Like, he's not going to be the same or whatever. So It was not the same? No, you were. You like, came in. On. You were the same. Like, no ill will. Like, no That's weird vibes. Sense. I'm hungry. What we got? Yeah. <laughs> same routine. Like, same routine. Same routine. I love you, though, sis. No matter what. Love you, what. too. Love yeah, too. man. You feel me? Fair to say. We Fair had a lot say. of cool moments, man. Uh, we, we even had some shit go viral. Viral, like you know, and it, it's just crazy. We had this this what? one clip right here go viral. 
You feel me? That was, it was just a. <laughs> <laughs> Moves, you burned out. <laughs> <laughs> that nigga Mac up. He, he did not want to be in that conversation. He, he, he said, "Bitch, I'm finna shit." Ex left. <laughs> no, Moose. He like Moose. Please, no. <laughs> shit. Oh fuck, I'm stuck in here. But that was a good one too, man. It was a good one, man. The shit, you feel me? Like. Shit went viral for a nigga, man. Like it was a good one. I was in the hospital some, watching that shit, bro. We had some real, real, real good moments, man. You feel me? So I love that too. That was man. a great fucking episode. <laughs> no, that shit was great. That was great. That was great. I, I got another one right here. It was went crazy too. <laughs> yeah, man. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> Hold on! <laughs> I'm a bitch! Hold on, bitch! Wait, wait, wait. I'm gonna tell you why I'm a hoe. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. Y'all thought you were GPS the no. way you no, were. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm a hoe. You. Look, so I'm back and look, I squeeze my legs and get my shit. I was like this, like, I could have just played it off, like, yeah, let me knock, knock, get up off me. But I was like, I was like this, like you uh, terrible. Uh, Please and I, no. Like, Push her off a little bit. I'm like, oh, nah. So what was going through your mind when she did that? Because you like, didn't know oh, it was going to happen. Crazy. <laughs> 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 I ain't fucking with this nigga. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. Oh, oh my god. Nigga like a nigga GPS. No, we been to we been to watch this, homie. Oh this my is, god. This is actually wild, homie. Look, 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 oh, I pushed it, that's embarrassing. But no, you got everybody else even, so I'm like, whoa! Look at my leg, it's still like... Look at Duno! <laughs> Duno's like, I'm not gonna look that way. Look, look, she like, sorry, sorry, sorry. He didn't know, he didn't know. He didn't, oh, shit. <laughs> she for sure, like, he paused. <laughs> yeah, he's a bitch. Oh, come on, homie. Oh, we got to rewind that because that was some whole shit. How you doing? Thank you. Look, I, <laughs> she really yeah. trying to get in there. In between the legs, like. She like, oh, no, yeah. open up. <laughs> this nigga's a bitch. This nigga really a hoe. Where was you at at this time? Right? Was <laughs> so he really ain't going to open his legs. Pause. Was, was you right there? You seen it? I was right there behind the cameras with Six and Trevor. I was literally right there watching it. And it's like, I, I understand. I wasn't really upset. It was just everybody around me. Jalen, Chelsea, everybody else, Bianca, everybody else is upset. But me, I kind of know what it is already, you know? All right. Like, they're just coming in here. Terrell doesn't know them. They're just coming in here with this guy. He's trying to be like, oh, yeah, I have bitches. I've been around this shit for over 10 years. So I kind of knew the deal. And then they, Chelsea and Jalen and everybody kind of made me get mad because they were so upset about it. They were ready to pack her up. They're like, bitch, get mad about it. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to get upset. Yeah. <laughs> but I ended up finding the girl like a, like a week later. I ended up finding her on Instagram and hitting her up. And I asked her to come on here so we could like, talk about it yeah. and explain it because she probably felt some type of way and I don't ever want to make a girl feel like that like I don't ever want to bash a girl or do nothing like that so I was like you so should come on here she's only fans girl yeah and, and she we didn't, didn't know, know that, that she was doing <laughs> <laughs> she didn't know that she was doing anything wrong she was just trying to right, do right, a job right, right, sure. cause the guy that brought her was probably like do this you know go extra <laughs> be, go crazy, you know, go you crazy. yeah so she was just doing her job, which I feel that. So I was like, okay, you should come on back on Fig and like we should talk about her or whatever. And our schedules just didn't align, but she was supposed to come on and we would talk about it. And it just got too behind. When she was able to come on, I'm like, you know what? It's not even worth it no more. Like nobody even cares anymore. Whatever. Right, right. Somebody said Dr. Umar would be proud. Yeah, he would be <laughs> proud. But nah. You feel me? But all the homies she would have, have all the homies Terrell, like, nah. If Terrell would have let her sit on him and she would have done what, whatever she did, I don't see myself getting upset. Like, really upset. So she so just no, starts no, twerking. No, no, no. What if she been like this? What if she been doing her ass like this the okay, whole time? Okay, that's it. I was trying to... Yeah, yeah, boy, yeah, boy, yeah, boy, boy. Yeah. But it was just <laughs> weird. Oh. It was just weird because the other girl didn't try to sit on AD. 
Like was, the other girl didn't. Try. I would understand I think, if like okay, we're you know we're a team. Whatever we're gonna go in here, we're gonna stand on these niggas like. But the other girl didn't try to sit on AD. She was only trying to sit on she you. Wanted like, so she like, wanted like, your girl, she seen what it is. What's going she on? She wanted your nigga. She, she like, seen what it was. What sit down? I'm gonna take my chance. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm taking my chance now. Uh, but real. I've been in those positions when we were on tour, going to the club, all this stuff in the UK, whatever. Like girls are just like that from overseas because they don't get to. See a lot. They don't get to experience so nice. USA niggas like this. Like so, they're a little thirsty. I'm not even gonna lie. They're a little thirsty and they're they're a little crazy. So when I saw her accent, I'm like, oh, okay, she's from the UK. Like I kind of understood. No, nah, she wasn't even from the UK. She's from Australia. Same thing, UK. No, nah, that's no overseas, it's not. bitch. You're overseas. <laughs> that's you're Australia. Thirsty. <laughs> and they just don't get to experience I'm in America. what we get to experience. Yeah, I'm getting a little upset. I'm trying to see what that do. Australia accent was going I'm crazy. From Australia. Yeah. So you were just so happy she sat on you, huh? Yeah, I was ecstatic. <laughs> ecstatic. <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Happy. Well, maybe oh, I'll hit her up again and she could come on again or something. <laughs> this nigga retarded, man. Yeah, her name's Haley Davis. Somebody said in the chat, shout out to Haley Davis. Yeah, little, name... little Iggy. You know what I mean? She's cute. She's a cute girl. Yeah, she's a little Iggy. Cute girl, cute body. Uh, This one right here. Don't worry about nothing. I don't see. even know if y'all can see this. I was in here. What? The... I did a couple push ups. <laughs> Yeah. Okay. Get it in. Yeah. Alone? Yeah. That's when I was in here. No, Nobody was in here with me. Everybody showed up late. And I did some push ups for the people, I was in here, man. Cause I did some push ups. I need, nah, you wasn't even in here. You feel me? I need, I need, uh, a matter of fact, I think AD came late. Niggas came late. <clears throat> so you started to stream up when I was in the chat for that, man. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, big push-ups in the building. Don't worry about nothing. What y'all talking about, Safe man? to say it was a great fucking year. Yeah. It safe was a to good say. year. Safe to yeah, say, Yeah, fair man. to say, fair to say. You know what I mean? Safe to say it was a good year. And this was right here. Platinum. You feel me? We went platinum right here. We got a million. <laughs> Hold on. See, this is a serious conversation. And he want to keep on yeah. laughing and being corny. I guess it can't. <laughs> See, that's why you should have been there. Oh, God. Oh, God. <laughs> hey, fair to say. That's I was in the hospital watching that shit like, fuck. So he was bullshit, huh? Yeah, look. He that's what he's taking it as a game. Yeah, let's look at him. Saint George. You Saint George. Yeah, look, look, look. That shit was crazy. That was a really good experience. <laughs> nah, a lot of motherfuckers say y'all say y'all can't hear. I don't know why y'all can't hear that shit. That we was gotta crazy. get that. But y'all can hear everything else, but y'all couldn't hear that one. I don't know why. Well, go they back and watch the video then. It's in the clip. Yeah, but that right there was crazy, man. Basically, what he was saying, just, you know, explaining what Dot was telling him, and you know what I mean, just telling him how to, where you slacking at, what you need to do, and. How you need to, you know, pay attention to your craft and, you know, get more serious to what we doing because we trying to be great, you know. So 
what that was to him that's what he be you know he is to me I, I take heed to a lot of shit that he say um he definitely called me and you know he always start off with it's your decision though but i'm gonna tell you i'm gonna give you my opinion yeah that's what I'm he gonna say give that's you how he talk. that's how yeah, talk. yeah i'm gonna give you my opinion you shouldn't do this don't fuck with him don't fuck with that don't do this that shit is nasty go over here and do that so you know and he watching too you know he he watch a lot so he, he be asking questions and you know asking what this is for why y'all doing this why y'all saying that don't react to that please don't do that you feel me so yeah i that's what you're supposed to be to your homies you feel me like if you don't know, speak it from experience so i really love that so this video was it, it had to go platinum it was it was meant to go platinum it just was a lot of gems and this shit even the next day with uh vince staples just with all the homies sitting down everybody coming through niggas is building shit in the background this whole background is just like just a testament of how far like we came like mm -hmm. from figueroa like you gotta like it's niggas crazy warner brothers let's get to that yeah. That's just Warner Brothers Studio. I don't. I forgot the number of the studio. Like, and what was sh what was actually being shot here? But it's all it's it's on the walls there. But just walking through Warner Brothers Studios, going to the bathroom. But just just that's just a testament of where you been, where we came from. It's just crazy. Like, nigga, I can I can remember me catching an eighty one. Man, like I I was on the bus stop, nigga, on Fifty Sixth Street, nigga, catching an eighty one. I can remember that shit, like. And then to for that for you know, from from where we at skate rings, living in Compton, roommate working together, and we sitting right here. It's just so my mind is doing this, and I'm trying to work. You feel me? And I'm trying to be professional. I'm still trying to laugh, talk, be the homie, make niggas comfortable. But it's just so much shit going on in my head. I'm like, what the fuck? You feel me? Is camera shit going on and you know, movie trailers, food outside. I'm like, shit is crazy. Yeah, very the same. And it's just, and I've seen so much. I've seen these niggas do shows, festivals, tours, all type of shit. We've been around so much shit. But it just, I don't know, just that moment, it was so much going through my head, though. But shout out to the homie again, man. Shout out to Q again. Shout out to um, bro. And he always tell me, like, shit, no, I need y'all. Just like, you know what I mean? Oh, y'all need me. Like, and that's just like so humble we were where niggas is coming from from it like you know where we all coming from we all doing something we all play a part in this shit so you know what i mean i'll be feeling like it's my job too to go and touch different homies to make sure they in a position just like he did you know what i mean like whatever position he got them in doing shit for him i'll be feeling like i gotta put a motherfuckers in position too if i'm you know in a in a higher space or in a higher you know what i'm saying motherfuckers looking at me like this right quick you feel me and i gotta go go touch everybody else i feel like i gotta do that shit too just like him you feel me just follow on the footsteps and make it trickle down and i hope everybody else do that <coughs> the same way you feel me like but yeah, big W's in the chat for this nigga Q, man. I love him to death for doing that. These moments when I looked at this shit because I just be, I don't know, I just be doing this shit and I be forgetting all the shit I be doing because I just be trying to move forward and move forward and move forward. So we need things like this to to reflect on and uh, you know what I mean to watch so so we can remind ourselves where we came from and what we doing, man. For real, I ain't even gonna lie to you. Uh, and this is just one of the big moments too. <laughs> Look, he Damian ain't even, Litter. He didn't even gotta uh -huh. say nothing. Right. A word. Yeah. This nigga don't do nothing. Yeah. Okay? He did what he he did he did what he wanted to do and he don't do nothing. Come on back on Fig, go to Cameron. And I'm gonna tell you why. Cause we cool. And I'm gonna tell y'all why right now, you feel me? And this nigga Joe Buttons explained it so well. Huh, hello. Y'all didn't get it then. Right. Now y'all kind of fucking get it. You feel me? Now you will kind of get it, man. If you didn't know, now you fucking know. So let's go over here to my boy over here and see what he talking about, man. Okay. That's 
That's nah, nah, don't talk to us. Nah, you, just yeah. heard, you just heard what Joe Button said. Who he fucks with? Back on Fig and Cam and them shit. Like, come on, bro. Like, you stupid. And I just feel like, sorry, Tyrell, I know you want to talk about it, but I just feel like it's because we're not fake and it's because we're real and it's because we're saying our true you know, self, being our true self, saying how we truly feel. We don't hold back nothing. We you? No, 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 no. They just saying they can't hear it. You know what I'm saying? Oh, the shit you showing yeah. Yeah. yeah, it's all My good. My bad. Go ahead. No, that's it. I'm just saying, like, we're always our true self. You say what you want. It... it it can come off as class count because we're not taking it serious. We don't care how the world feels. This is how we feel. This is our opinion. That's what it is. And that's how other people see it too. And I love that. I love that you can, yeah, call me a class count because I'm being myself. And that's y'all it. are funny though. That, that's, you the, know? that's the thing. That's why they, people uh, linger and fuck with us because we speak our minds. Yeah. And you're funny naturally. Naturally. This like, ain't no show. Yeah, it's not a show. You don't have to be like acting funny or telling trying to tell jokes is just what it is and people think that it's funny i love that i love that he acknowledged everybody uh, back on fig like i love that no for sure i do shout out to joe buttons and his mm-hmm. podcast man no nah, i really I, I do I, I really do and just acknowledging back on fig and just acknowledging everybody that's ever been on here ever yeah. fucked with us you feel me like and doing it up man class clowns is almost equivalent to most popular in school Mm-hmm. It was either you as a class clown or most popular because they both was kind of like the same. They both was kind of like equal. Like, but for yeah. him to say that, I'm watching, and then to say and Cam, you feel me? Like because we two in the same. Like we really don't give a fuck. You feel me? Like Cam's been through way more shit than me. Of course, you feel me? He's way more famous, knows has way more experiences and shit like that. But I got experiences too. But the experiences I do have, I'll I'll, I'll explain them just like that because I don't give a fuck. Fuck yeah. him, her, him, and her. Like, oh, well, like, you niggas can't do nothing to me. I ain't trying to be blackball. Blackball out of what, bitch? I don't go to fuck. I'm fuck you and your party. Like, I don't give a fuck. We in here. We chilling. So to be acknowledged like that, just a little bit. It's just tight. Like, I, I love that. Big W's for that, man. Shout out yeah. my nigga um, Joe Button for that shit. Like, and that shit is just tight to me, man. Okay, that shit is just question. tight. <clears throat> yeah. All right, boom. So, <laughs> so, do you think Cam and uh, Mace know who back on figures? Or you think it went across their desk, they heard about us? It went across their desk, and it went across their desk because Damian Lillard. It went across their desk, niggas knew. From who? ESPN? Uh, when they talked about us on ESPN? That, but still, he only did us and them. And them. Oh. That's it. So he did. So okay. that's it. He don't do. He ain't went on none of that shit. He ain't went on none of these basketball niggas podcasts. Right, and right. These niggas booming. Right, right. So he ain't went on none of that shit. He so, came so for over sure here. You think he, they know about us? Mason Cam know about. He ran across their desk. I don't know if they know about us for sure. But I'm going to say, yeah, I mean. He probably told him, like, I just left him doing back on fig, yeah, 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 but if killer know about me, that's yeah. tight. Oh, God, that's what I was trying to get to. Like, if killer know about me, that's tight, Damn it, man. Mace, come on, they legends. Niggas know, you feel me? For sure. Shout out my nigga Jack. He said, nigga, they know. Yeah. Yeah, man. Shout out W's in the chat for Damian, Damian Lillard, too, for man. Sure. He came over here, signed the ball, no problem. You feel me? Signed his shoe, no problem. Very and nice. they talking about coming to Milwaukee, no problem. Problem. Yeah. What you want? Yeah. Come on. Yeah. Nobody going to Milwaukee too, by the way. I'm gonna go though. I'm gonna take a flight. You know what I'm saying? I'm I already did, yeah, yeah, yeah. I already did the holler at my nigga TF. He said, I'm gonna go fuck it. I'm gonna go. I'm yeah. like, yeah, we finna go all red carpet treatment. Let's do that shit. You feel me? Uh Somebody said T Real can't clap, man. <laughs> <laughs> right, man, y'all change. niggas is crazy, man. <laughs> Fuck y'all niggas, man. But yeah, man. Shout out everybody in here right now, man. We almost got six thousand people in here right now. Mess with us. Don't worry about nothing. Make sure you like the video. I love that button. Let me get my little Instagram. I love that button, Terrell. Eh? <laughs> 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 it's just so about pressing that motherfucking button, boy. I want to press the other one. This so real bad. Instagram live. While we in here, make sure y'all. Uh, click the link right now. Yeah. Um, you funky cocky bitch. Yeah. Hey, the button remind me of the, the Chinese girl on Rush Hour. Push the fucking button. Remember she had the uh, the bomb Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. <laughs> that nigga Smokey said, you heard it. Push the button. Said, Push the button. <laughs> you heard Push it. Push the goddamn button, man. She's like, yeah, push the button. <laughs> 
<laughs> well, I love that movie. Oh God! Well, he Such ain't the same because he was on that Epstein Island. What's wrong with this Epstein Island shit? What does that mean? What, what, I can't, Epstein I don't, I don't was fucking tell. with kids, and he had a whole island. I'm gonna put it in perspective for you so you can get it because we get him. Yeah. He had a whole island where he was fucking with kids. What? And niggas was taking flights over there to go so, do it up. So they saying that uh, it was a gang of famous people that went to that island. So they saying they got done up. <laughs> fucking with kids. Mm -hmm. Real. Wow. So he and you know we don't know for sure. He's still alive. The David, whatever his name. No. Is. He's in. He's in jail, right? He's in jail over. But that nigga gone. Oh, he's he gone. Died. That nigga died. Oh damn! What? I didn't know that. <laughs> nah. Fuck that nigga. Oh god. <laughs> <laughs> Playing with them kids, man, that's crazy, homie. God, that's that. Yeah, you can't be doing that shit, man. Nah. You, yeah, you can't be doing that shit. Shame on you. I saw something on Die TikTok slow. that made me so sick to my stomach last night. I was watching this guy, and it was like the the guy had a TikTok where he like went after predators and like underage like people that talk to underage girls, and he acts like them or whatever. So he confronted them on TikTok, and the guy was acting like he was just so like it was just numb to him. He didn't care about like it was just so regular to him. So he was like, "Well, uh, what about your four year old daughter?" He's like, "Oh yeah." He was like, "I just like that she's just so innocent. Like she's so innocent, and I could just do whatever." But to his four year old daughter. Not no anybody regular stranger whatever not four year old his fucking daughter his blood and it made me sick to my stomach I'm just like people are really sick out here you don't know people that you run into the grocery store wherever people are really sickening to my stomach I'm like leave the kids alone let them grow up live their life be the best that they could be that shit blew me it blew me it really did I don't like them niggas like mm. that shit is weird. Chat, man, right now, man. Y'all give me old. some context on this, man. The young lady who just got off of murder and she's doing all these interviews. I don't, I didn't do none of the research on that right now, but it just, I don't know. Something about her mother was doing some to her. I didn't do all the research of her, but what's her name, though? Because I'm going to kind of look it up right now. I'm going to see what it do, man. Gypsy Rose? Gypsy Rose. Yeah. You know about that? Yeah, I know about Gypsy Rose. Wow, it's tell crazy. Me, yeah, tell me about it. So let me just give you basically the rundown. Her yeah. mom was trying to get money from the state, whoever she could, fans, whatever. So she was portraying that her daughter was sick. And her daughter, I feel so bad for her daughter, Gypsy Rose, because she had to have so many surgeries. Her mom got like something in her body taken out. She had to feed her through like a tube. Her mom was doing all this so she can get a brand new home. She could have all her bills paid. She could have all this. Her mom was doing it for all the wrong reasons, but making her kids suffer through this and making her do unnecessary shit to her body that she didn't need to so the girl was like 18 19 years old when she finally figured out like she's like i'm grown now what's going on bitch right. i'm in a wheelchair i can definitely walk she was like i'm definitely walking her mom made her sit in a wheelchair to look like she was you know so her mom was actually fucked up in the head and crazy but she made her daughter suffer through all this, thinking she had to be in a wheelchair, feeding through a tube, not regular, couldn't be normal, couldn't hang out with her friends, couldn't do normal stuff, go to the mall, go to the movies or whatever, because she's sick, supposedly. Had her had to have her teeth taken out because she has claimed she had something that she had to take a certain medicine for that made her teeth fall out. It's just sick. It's just so nasty. Like, you would never want somebody that you brought into this world to have to go through that. So she ended up meeting a boy, and she kind of convince him to kill her mom for her because she's like i'm stuck i need to get out of this my mom's tripping i'm telling you i'm not sick i'm good <laughs> like you know and she had her boyfriend kill her mom and they both went to prison her husband her boyfriend went to prison for life she went to prison for however many near however many years she just got out and now she's acting a damn fool so her boyfriend didn't snitch basically but i mean so they both went to jail for murder and her boyfriend didn't tell because she just went to jail and she I'm got sure he out. told because but, he went to life because he actually killed her. But the girl, Gypsy Rose, convinced him, please kill my mom. If you love me, get me out of this situation. But she still should get life too, though. That's what I you, said. You the person, like, like, but she really. just recently got released. I don't want to speak on how many years she served because I'm not sure. But she just recently got released and that's how I know about it because I didn't know about her story. I just found wow. out. She just saw, recently got released from prison. So I just but know the she, man I just is still know, there for life. I, so I just know she got out of, out of prison. She killed her mama. And she mm -hmm. just like, nigga, what's the deal? Yeah, that's 
like how and basically. she doing interviews. Niggas like, but some people in the comments is just like, shit, do it up, bitch. Fuck your mama. And some is like, bitch, you murdered your mama. Blah 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 blah. But my I feel thing like is, she murdered her mom. I would be like, you know what? Save me. If I met a man on the internet, because she met him on the internet. If I met a man on the internet, I'd be like, you know what? My mom's crazy. I'm 19, 18 years old. She didn't even know how old she was. Poor girl. She didn't know nothing. Her mom was just lying to her whole life. But I'd just be like, help me out. Like, help me escape. She did 10 years. That's not enough to, <laughs> to plot death. Man, fuck her mama. Look, check this out. If me just looking at it, just right, looking right. from what she's saying, her mama got me fucked up. So, you, your girlfriend, she do that to you. And then your girlfriend, like, man, let's do it up. And then she get off. She only get 10. You get an L. What you doing? If you... Fa- oh, no. She ruined your life. Oh, no. You facing an L. She ruined your And you your looking life. over here like, bitch, this ain't even my problem. Right, right. You got, you got, you got, and they giving you 10. She the one told me. <laughs> she like, it's bigger than Nino Brown. <laughs> she told me. <laughs> Hey, she fed me the dope and she told me to do it, man. Yeah, but you actually did it, you fucking dummy. She manipulated me. That's a real thing. She gave me that medicine my mama was giving. Right, right. And we just both went crazy. Right, I'm going to go Charleston White, bitch. (laughs) Hey, 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 we going together, baby. They did. Which they did. No, they didn't. She got 10. He got all day. She went and laid down with 10 like that ain't nothing like this. So I'm finna get out and do it. She went out when she was probably 19, 20. She went in. So now she's out. She's probably my age, 30 something. She got her new man. Her and her man are out here. Right. Yeah, he gone. He forgot about it. Wow. But. She's like, okay, cool. I made you kill my mom for me, which is crazy because I wouldn't even want to kill the lady that brought me into this earth. I would just want to get away from you. They said he was autistic too. Oh, he needs to be uh, free. Yeah, he needs to be free if that's the case. He needs that's to be a case free. worth fighting. She might only have a limited time out of jail before he starts seeing all these clips on the, the news. <laughs> for real. So he's like, hey, hey, hey. Ain't bring no this way. case back up. Yeah, bring this reach back out, up. reach out. That I mean, bitch did. I remember. She did it. <laughs> <laughs> but my honest opinion is if she said kill my mom, you should be in jail just amount of time. Yeah. Like, I would never want to kill my mom. Like, I would just be like, hey, like, help me get out of here. Like, help me escape. Help me disappear. I would be on that. I wouldn't be like, hey, kill this lady. Right. Like, she's not beating you, starving you, none of that. She's just saying that you're sick. I mean, I well, she kind of is. It, it kind of is. It kind of is. That's it. YouTube, y'all talking about where they put this shit right there? And you, yeah, it's a G-tube. yeah, you feed her through the tube, so she couldn't actually enjoy she eating. eating through her mouth, so she had to just take like the the smoothies and shit, like yeah. that uh, that boost. And milk. that's an experience in life. Like you want to feel popcorn, you want right. to feel mashed potatoes, you want to feel fried chicken, right. different textures in life. Like bitch, you're Man. making me get through a tube just so I can uh, uh, be alive. Free him, right? For sure, free Chat, him. Free him. Ain't no motherfucking way you finna be out here living your life with a whole nother nigga that just knocked your mama down. The story is insane. Nah. I've been like obsessed with it Look, since I've all, seen I'm it on autistic. TikTok. I'm autistic. I don't know what's going on. Who is this bitch? <laughs> but the lady, look. The lady said to the new guy, you rock my world every night. Tell him that you rock my world every night. She's out here tripping. She's grown, though. You got to show me her when it's over. I, I she looks it. crazy. Let me see. You rock my world every night. And he looks crazy, too. He looks crazy, too. She playing with Chili now or something? Hey, no, she has a new man. Free they, that man. Huh? They really? met on a dating site, too. But he is a simp. Free that simp. Autistic simp. Nigga, you So a this bitch. is her, and this is her new man. Let me see this shit. <laughs> she looks crazy because oh and she God. talks crazy because she's had certain shit taken out of her her mm-hmm. throat this her Instagram mm-hmm. 6.7 million oh mm-hmm. my God we're killing her mama and oh. she looked off the whole story is just yeah, insane she looked off though oh <sighs> the whole yeah. story is just insane she's a psychopath but let's get into this man you know what I'm saying the topic of the story man we got in my boy uh, Cat Williams going up I know he was uh, we, we had the conversation going on but you know <laughs> but Cat Williams you know he stated that he has never done drugs this is verbatim he's, he's never lying. done drugs Nobody has never seen him done drugs uh, have you know never seen him did drugs at all. There's no one that came forth that has seen him or told they seen Cat Williams doing drugs. 
And this nigga Smack called me and said, hey, that's a lie. Facts. 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 So Cat Williams said all of that shit. Everybody saying he, he, you know, he was truthful. He, you know, he's he's a uh, he, he's he's outing comedians. You know what I'm saying? He's how he's out in the higher ups, the the Illuminati. He doing all the shit. They said he was telling the truth. He's ruffling feathers, but that's one thing he lied about. And Smack said, "I got it. I got the proof. I was there." So For tell sure. us about it, Smack. That nigga was a stone cold crackhead on 59th and Denver. <laughs> he was gonna keep it clean. He was buying dope on 59th and Denver. This is something I can't make up. We laughing, I'm joking about it now. But this is my right hand of God. That nigga was smoking on 59th and Denver, going to the shopping center right there on Slauson and Figueroa. Man, that nigga was a smoker, man. We gonna keep it clean. He didn't have no teeth. He had see the snagging tooth nigga on my mama. I ain't bullshit, nigga. I ain't bullshit. He so was on crack. So he was he was selling. You know, who was he getting dope from? The homies. He was getting. <laughs> yep. H.I.P. So, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? You yeah, he me? rest in peace. He rest in peace. The dude he was getting dope from is rest in peace. Like, you feel me? Can't nobody get convicted for this. But I knew the dude that was serving this nigga. And he was smoking dope. He was smoking crack, nigga. I swear to God. Man, I'm laughing because it's funny. <laughs> this shit. That's on my mama heartbeat. Yes. He was smoking dope, nigga. Swear yeah. to God. I even went through there to find some old nigga. Like, you remember dude was over here? They like, you was over here. So, to have your story correct... You seen Cat Williams buying dope? Yes. Smoking dope. Put the pipe like this. <sighs> On 59th. In Denver. Be- <laughs> 59th in Denver, be as that. Be- the dead end. At the dead end. Yeah, it's a dead end street. Oh mm-hmm. my God. So now, I don't now, know. Now Cat you know I'm not lying. Because listen, what's the name even said? Kevin Hart said it. Why they cut him off? Because he was doing dope. Mm. But Cat Williams used to have parties with cocaine going up in that motherfucker. He said he never did none of that. Oh, man. Hey, big plates. Because you was in there doing it. <laughs> <laughs> I used to fuck around with the little, you know what I mean? Cat but Williams I, called on it. <laughs> Cat Williams, I mean, we like, don't need to know what's going on. You're in Hollywood, on. you're in Los Angeles, California, you're in Hollywood. You're gonna do dope. I'm sorry. No, no, hell no, 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 you're not. Listen, I'm gonna keep it clean. No, I'm gonna keep it clean. No, 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 I'm gonna keep it clean, bro. I've been clean what five years now, bro. He, I ain't, he I wasn't in Hollywood. This no. nigga was on feet. No, but I'm saying I'm talking about he as far as when I, when I start when I when I quit this shit. You feel me? As far as the powder, you feel me? Like yeah. everybody know I used to fuck around. Ain't wasn't no shame in my game. I go up in front of Obama, throw up a gang sign to him, like nigga. He powdered up. Yeah, like in front of him, like nigga. You feel me? Like it been five years. I've been clean on dibble and dab on fuck around, but I know. For facts, dude was smoking dope, and I know facts. It was big cocaine plates in that motherfucker. Everybody was like, going up the upper room. <laughs> I ain't bullshitting. I've been My with boy. a lot of celebrities, man. A lot of them. Me too. Who would have knew that Smack would fucking expose my nigga Cat Williams? So look, check this out. <laughs> Cat Williams gonna come through. He gonna listen to your story. He yeah, gonna be like, could. who the fuck is this nigga? This nigga don't know what he got going on. And this nigga ain't got no proof. Prove it, nigga. Because that's, you know, that's I'm his whole fact. I'm gonna just tell him one name. Prove gonna, it, nigga. He gonna be like, but yeah. you, but that one name, the world ain't gonna know. You gotta have a picture, a video, or something. I, I it's still some niggas that's alive that was around in that era. I swear to God. So you got you got a couple niggas that I can got vouch a couple for of that. niggas that vouch for it. Swear to God, that will pull up right on back on field. You be like, he ain't lying. Yeah, he came over here and he was buying crack, nigga. That nigga had the funnels and put that shit in there and was blowing like a broke choo choo train, nigga. And matter of fact, it was a homie that helped the nigga get into the comedian shit. Like, this truth in the detail, bro. It was yeah. a Hoover that helped that nigga. Hey, bro, you funny. You need to go. Do- and it was a Hoover nigga that helped him go and get in the... Co- and- I swear to God, bro. In the five nines. I ain't bullshit. In the bullshit. five nines. Man, I ain't bullshit. I swear to God. And he started taking it serious. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh, God. I swear to God, I ain't bullshit, bro. So, if Cat Williams see this right now, he get at you. What we doing? We gonna tell him pull up. We ain't got two in the same. Yeah, we ain't got two niggas that doing dope and all that. Y'all yeah. tell the truth. That pull up, <laughs> pull up, cat. 
But look, hey, this is crack this a real thing, so I, knew. I ain't like, bitch, I ain't no crackhead, bitch. I was blurring powder. I never did crack. Bitch, it was a crackhead. No. <laughs> powder, that's some, that's Wait, some crackhead. What's the Yo. difference between yeah. powder and crack? Because powder what is, is powder. It? Crack, you got to put water, you got to mix it. Hey, what Cat Will rock. Hey, Cat, run this. Cat Will told you what you got. You got to mix it, you got to put the water, you got to do that. <laughs> powder different, you understand me? I ain't pushing. Oh, I sniffed a little cocaine a couple times to see how it was. You know, I ain't gonna lie to you, but I wasn't cracked out there with you and uh, Cat Williams. I, I was just living life. That's the better living drug. I know I ain't gonna say that because I don't want nobody to do it. Don't do it. You feel me? Like I said, I'm clean. I ain't promoting that shit. Fuck that shit. That's why All I call you Smack Water. <laughs> oh, that's Whoa, why you got you smack was, water. You did shit? No, and I heard that it's somebody else in Texas named Smackwater or something. Oh, it's a nigga in Texas that's named Smackwater, and he do shit. I don't know what he do. I ain't gonna lie on that man. I don't know him from a can of paint. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, so I how know do Cat Williams who dope though. How do y'all feel about oh, the unreleased shit. footage of him and Brittany Renner? It was like unreleased because the who, first who footage, and white. Yeah, nah, they ain't talking about Cat Williams. Hold on. Oh, I thought y'all were talking about yeah, Charles. We can get Wayne. to we can get to that though. I think it's pretty right. juicy. I'm like, oh, okay. Why y'all didn't release that? Like when y'all re- you, they were holding on to that. Now, they were holding trying, on to he that. He was trying to fuck something. No, That's but why. they went live and she did that. I seen it already. Like I've been seeing that. She walked up on it, gave him a little lap dance. They I kissed seen that. though. I didn't see that part, too. That's what I'm saying. Shout they out They just up. released shout that out footage. Up. They were kissing. Ooh, shout out. Uh, and I she was really nigga. on him, kissing on his yeah. nigga and all kinds of stuff. I'm like, oh, my God. And then he admitted, like, yeah, I was hard. I was about to come on myself. Yeah. That's what he said. <laughs> I love that nigga. He was like, I was, <laughs> I I was, I was hard. I was about to he come on myself. He said, I was going to explode. <laughs> yeah, because oh he's like, dang, God. this young bitch or young woman, like, on me like this, kissing me, kissing me on my neck, all up on me, ass out, pussy out. He's like, whoa, this is crazy. Hey, they love that little bitch, homie. That she like superhead, man. I seen her do Shannon Sharp too. I'm like, why is she on Shannon oh, Sharp? She was, oh, she was on there too. They try, she Dion Sanders brought her to the, the, the facility. They like them niggas trying to fuck hey, them old niggas, 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 niggas. I don't give a fuck, nigga. Oh, this you is, a rat? No, fuck with that. Let me talk. I don't. I see the rats in the chat. I pay attention, bro. This is all content, nigga. Me but that content, nigga was on dope, though. Let me talk. That nigga was on dope, so you can say I'm telling whatever. That nigga lied no, to no. y'all, bitch. He was smoking crack cocaine, <laughs> motherfucker. You know what I mean? He was free basing, nigga. Fuck you talking about, nigga? Like about a bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. What all this is a clip, man. They trying to figure out who Van is. All this is one clip, man. It is Cat such a mystery this, with Van, man. isn't it? Man. Everybody wants to know who Van is. They ain't gonna never Have know. Have you met Van? Van? What do he do? He does everything for Van. <laughs> <laughs> Have Van met me? <laughs> That's the question. I, I, I probably know. did. I probably did. Van met you. Okay, oh, okay. y'all met. Yeah, yeah. He is square. You know, not square, but he's no, a young, he, cool kid. You feel me? Yeah. College kid. You know, he just went through finals. Shout out to you, Van. He just went through finals. I wish you the best. I hope you pass. I hope you real go reserve. exceed whatever dreams you have in this life. Shout out to Van. He does everything on um, back on fig as far as clips, Instagram reels, thumbnails, clips, everything. Like oh, every- Instagram, he control all that. And YouTube, yeah. So he be the one putting all the bullshit to real. Hey, title this. <laughs> yeah, title. Hey, I know you, bitch. Hey. But he's not the only mod. People think that. He He's the only mod. But I heard not- that in this mod game that it's bigger mods that's bigger than that could do more shit than with the other mods or everybody could do the same. I have no idea. So we should nah. shake your head here, Terrell. So- no, nah, it's a couple of niggas that's in here that could do it up. Okay, why? Which, what mod you made me? Or just you can do it up. Yeah, you just can do it. Just a general one. one. <laughs> <laughs> even if I made you, you the craziest just, mod, which you, you are, do bare minimum. you don't even know how to do none of that I shit. I swear to God. I, <laughs> I mean... So okay. it really don't even fucking matter. So the real question is, the real question is, who is the most? You know, who's the the mod that can do the most? Me. Okay, the owner of the page. The owner of the page. So what about who's the next? Van or Van? Yes. Eleven. Who's seven? Sorry, seven. Damn, eleven and seven. <laughs> six. I'm drunk. Yeah. Damn. Okay, she six. called that nigga eleven so and seven. So many fucking nicknames. Okay. Seven so, eleven. What's the deal, cuz? Yes. Like, yes. who is the next one in line and can they I can't all do tell the same? Niggas. I can't tell niggas. 
Okay. But Yaz is one of them because that's one of our OGs. You Man, feel me? Yaz been here. Fucking with Shout us. Shout out to Yaz. Sure, so y'all should already fucking know. You feel me? Me. But I don't even fucking touch that shit because I don't even know. I'm like smack. I don't know what the fuck's right. going on. I have no idea either. And, uh, you know, I don't want to tell y'all. You feel me? Oh, big deal. I- I'm pretty sure he don't even know how to do none of that He's shit. He's a either. mod. Yeah, he in here right now. You feel me? Uh, big why deal. the fuck is he a mod? <laughs> So, Big deal uh, can do whatever he want in this motherfucker. Here, erase y'all, delete y'all, bring y'all back, take y'all away, all the whole shit. He, okay. probably, he don't even know. But I just told not him now, so now he know. Not so to change the story, but uh, one of my day one homies, Oscar, grew up on the block. He's mm-hmm. from El Salvadorian. Mm-hmm. Grew up with me, born and raised. His wife fucks with you so tough. She wanted to know if she could get the, the nail shit with you, you be talking about on your Instagram. Oh, yeah. Money for nails? Yeah, she wants some. She yeah, like, for you sure. feel me? So, shout out Moko and this girl. Y'all heard her. They've been asking me this for over two weeks. Like, smack over. I'm like, oh, I be forgetting. They like, soon you get the little cocktail and you forget. I'm like, should I be loaded? Not she the cocktail. Do it, you know what I mean? So, does she do nails or she, she just likes yeah, nails? Yeah, she do nails. Oh, okay. And she I'll wanted, send her she, everything then. Yeah, for sure. I'll send her everything. We have top coats. They both the grew up on 51st with us like tools. six kids. Okay. They yeah. date one 51st Street babies. I just send me their address and I'll send them whatever. For sure. I would love for her to have she it or love her to you. use she it. She love you. Yeah, yeah. Thank you. Shout out to you. What's her name? Do you know her name? I can't remember her name, but it's Oscar uh, Girl. Shout and out I grew to up Oscar's. with this girl. I raised this girl. And that's sad. I feel bad right now. You do. You should. Uh, damn. I fucked up. I feel bad. I definitely send her stuff. I would love to get any nail techs that are out there. If any nail techs are watching or any of you guys, girls, do nails or love nails, I would love to give away a, a collection, give away a whole one of everything for money for nails, any of that. I would love to do that. My bad, sis. I done lost the guy. That's crazy. And I'm really Shout out crazy. money for nails, man. You feel me? Make sure y'all go to the site. Big sales going up. If not, you feel me? If your girl love nail polish or whatever the case may be, gel not. Gel polish, nail polish, any accessories, make sure you go to uh, moneyfornails.com. Sosorella.com, too. You feel me? Definitely have all the sales, too. We getting rid of a lot of shit. Make sure you go to the damn <laughs> sales tab. Get that shit. Go all the way and, uh, and get that shit. We got Depops, too, for me, Heather, Sorella. You know what I'm saying? We get rid of a lot of shit for this new year, so make sure you go ahead and get us get that shit. You can have it. Don't worry about nothing. So make sure you pay attention to all the sales. Make sure you sign up for the emails too, because yeah. that's gonna tell you everything that you need to know. So make sure you sign up for that shit, because I know a lot of motherfuckers. When I see it, I ain't even gonna lie to you. I be clicking right out of it. But go to the emails because the email is gonna give you what you need to special know. Special discounts. Yeah, special, sure discounts. special discounts. Special discounts. So for my Poshmark, and Terrell has a Depop, it's basically like a, a our garage sale, basically. It's just mm-hmm. like used clothes, we worn it. It's 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 like a cool site. I like Poshmark and Depop. Um, but it's like our used clothes. So like if I have a pair of jeans that I'm never going to wear again, worn them out four or five times, never going to wear again, I put them on Poshmark, sell them for the low, whatever. So make sure you follow my Poshmark. It's in my link tree on my Instagram. Make sure you follow Terrell's Depop because he's selling Supreme hats. He's selling Shows all kind of crazy shit. shit. This bitch over yeah, there just I got it. But, I, but I got used shit and new shit. I got brand new shit that I ain't even touched never opened but you've been that doing shit. this for a minute you, I've been here you talk about dropping you putting shoes and all this shit on you need a deep pop. No, I ain't got to give it away. Shit. You know y'all, want, hey, y'all want to smack deep pop? <laughs> no, bitch, I give away shit. Thumbs up if y'all want to smack deep pop. <laughs> Somebody wants to smack Deepop. Deepop wearing all his clothes. Hey, He's giving them I, away I, to his homies. I, I, He's giving them away to his homies. He's giving them away to his homies. He's giving them away to his homies. I'm giving brand new shit away to my homies. That's facts. Yeah. They get brand new shit to your homies. Brand new shit. Oh, okay. Brand new Maybe shit. Maybe one more. Ain't never getting more. They smoke the cigarette all in the hole. Yeah, all right. I'm going to be like Mike. Not Mike. What's his name? Michael Jordan. My shit going to be classic, nigga. You going to wish you had some of my Deepop, nigga. Shit, they fuck this out loud, bitch. But I'm going to smack Deepop. Yeah. When I'm dead and gone, y'all gonna wish y'all had some of that shit, motherfucker. For real. Nigga said, no, we don't want to smack D-Pop. But you no, want your real no. stinky ass no. shoes and pants, bro. Y'all got me hot. <laughs> See, y'all be picking and choosing, hey, nigga. You ain't me favoritism ass yeah. shit. No, but, we don't but want the D-Pop. They want your jeans. They want your shoes. Yes, I'm fly. <laughs> You don't want this this go go on Depop. This hat going on Depop. So y'all don't want these fly ass minimum things, yeah? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this hat will go on Depop in a couple months. And how much you gonna sell it for? I'm gonna wear this bitch and out. how much you gonna sell it for? I bought it for 275 
So y'all wanna wear this sweaty ass hat that ain't been sweating in? Yep, I'm gonna sell it for like 80. What's the brand? <laughs> oh shit. You What's the brand? What I mean? Come on, my nigga, you feel me? Get in there, do it up, man. Y'all see this? This gonna go on Depop. Y'all gonna get way more, bitch. <laughs> yeah. Wait, do shout out up. to Lexi and AD be- or Lexi because she's the one that told me, oh yeah, sell on Poshmark, sell on Depop. Like, yeah, it's cool because I sell brand new clothes out the box. That's all I've ever known. I never resold my clothes, so this is all new to me. But she's like, yeah, get on there. My shit be selling. I don't even really promote in there or nothing. And she has AD one too. So make sure you check out their po- it's Poshmark or Depop. I'm not sure which one it is, but make sure you check it out because AD has all his hats on there and everything so do and it, people do are it, buying that shit do it got it do it come with a picture of you on there and they tell me no you just any picture oh, yeah, you yeah, want I'm finna to serve show you bitch them. ass niggas I'm finna put all type of shit on that motherfucker <laughs> you don't want smack G-pop bro <laughs> Hey, you you lied to me. You lied to me. You got me. so much shit too that you ain't even got, touched probably got, girl, I, one time. Hey, listen, I got shit in tubs like this. I swear to God. Sell it. I swear to Sell God. Sell it and I get do. the chili, dude. For sure, I'm finna get on God that motherfucker. God damn, homie. Hey, yeah, I got shit I ain't never wore. Niggas need on the porch. Niggas need clothes. You should just have or a you box. Can still give just away. have a box on the porch and just put take it. Put what? it right on that motherfucker. Take it. I bet yeah, you they I ain't take gonna do it. it. I just I just pass them out to the homies that ask me and that that want it. You feel me? Man, so. put that shit on the porch. It's too no. much shit. No, no, I gotta put it on Depop. <laughs> <laughs> I put it on Depop. Yeah, I put it on Depop. But I mean, now I do have certain piles. Depop. I'm like, okay, this is a Depop pile. This is a giveaway pile. Like I can give this away to right. somebody who you know will appreciate it or will need it or whatever basis, whatever shit. That's like you know. Whatever, I'm like, okay, I'll put it on Depop. So you can have two different piles. You don't have to put everything on Depop. It's not our whole fucking wardrobe on there. It's just certain things. <laughs> but yeah, man, shout out to all y'all, man. Uh, all like my 60, this video. 60, 60 motherfuckers in here, man. Make sure y'all like this video <laughs> one time, man. Yes, sir. Back on Fig. If you've not subscribed to the channel, make sure you subscribe to the channel one time, man. Let's go back to my Imperial shit, man. Have to read that shit one more time with him. You hat. feel me? Shout out Imperial, man. Make sure y'all hit that uh, QR code for us one time. Yes, sir, man. Delivering the 50 states. Don't worry about nothing. Right to your yeah. dough. Shout out yeah, to Imperial, the man. brand that has over 16 years in the game. They're dope because it's legal cannabis shipped straight to your doorstep in all 50 states. And right now they're giving away a free two gram THC a diamond infused pre-roll with any order each pre-roll comes with 1.5 grams of pure THC top shelf flower 0.5 grams of THC and diamond and reusable glass tip for all the luxury smoke that we love make sure you shout out Imperial or make sure you check out Imperial and use our QR code use our and use our code F-I-G-G yeah, there make sure you hit the QR code and make sure you use our code F I G G. Let's do it. Let's read some uh, um, super chats. Come on, Heather, what we got? You hear what I mean? Shout out to Gravy Davy. He said five ninety nine. He didn't say anything, but shout out to you. Shout out to Ali Boys. He said four ninety nine. He said two questions. Have Smack smoked a stick before? And does Heather's fart smells like a honey bun and fifty cents of Shasta? <laughs> shout out from North Torrance. What's this? Oh, you smoke Shasta? Uh, sure. No, no. My no. farts do not smell good. I don't, it, know. I don't know. You I don't know. know. I don't know. You know. <laughs> you know. Yeah, he know, bitch. Yeah, you years. know, bitch. And he hates when I fart. <laughs> that shit is just like stupid <laughs> ugly. But you can fart around her and it ain't no problem? No, he tries as hard as not to fart around me. Oh, you me. gonna die, bitch. You <laughs> hold that shit in. I'm gonna let loose. <laughs> like, the fuck out of here. You human. I'm human. Bye. <laughs> Niggas trying to act like they sleep. <laughs> You, you, you fucking weirdo! I don't care. I have to fart. I'm farting. Y'all fucking crazy. I'm like, I try to have the curtains. What if do I went under the covers when they do that? But what if I went to roll over and I wanted to just, you know what I'm saying, touch the cheek already? But before I touch the cheek, it's like. I'm already getting myself ready to roll over and it's a <laughs> I'm hot. I'm gonna get out the covers. It's I'm out going of there. Back. It's good. It's gonna come out sooner or later. If it has to come out, it has to come parasite, out. Parasite. So it might That's as well cool. come out before you get up on it. That's cool. <laughs> <laughs> hey God, that the shit noise you make is crazy. Yeah. Yeah. So, Cause it ain't just like boop, right? <laughs> <laughs> it ain't more than them. Or silent. I be hoping uh, they're silent. I'm like, I'm about to fart right now. Please be silent. Niggas be at the niggas. Nasty. 
Get oh. the fuck out of here. It's human. Like Smack said, it's yeah. fucking human. I like yeah. it. Take me as I am. Why right. you around me? I'm letting <laughs> it. So answer his question. Answer his super chat. Does it smell like honey and shot? I don't know because I ain't trying to do none of that. You know. I ain't trying. I'm, I'm all fresh air on the side of the bed. I'm on the whole nother side of the bed. Shout out to Glasses Face. He said 199. He said, how can I send my address for the mushies? No, we finna do some giveaways right now. Don't worry about nothing. Make sure you go ahead and uh, download uh, Prize Picks right now. And when you download Prize Picks, you can just, uh, you know what I'm saying, deposit five bucks. You feel me? Hit the email. Hit the email. What the fuck is the email? But we gonna get into it since you asked me, though. But I'm gonna get into it later, though. But I'm gonna at least give you the email. B-O-F-Picks at gmail.com. Hurry your ass up. You feel me? We can be one of the motherfuckers. I can give away some shit right now. You feel me? I'm giving away mushies, house shoes, tees, all type of shit. Come on. No chill sent four ninety nine. He said my twenty fifth birthday is tomorrow, and I want Heather sing that shit for me. <laughs> Happy ready? birthday, brother! Let's go! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, dear! A uh, no chill. Happy five deuce day to you. <laughs> Happy birthday from back on pig. Um, a- Abraham Brema sent 10 euros. Shout out to the UK. He said, bruh, very true. Reminds me of my family Christmas. Everyone thinks it's going to be costly. Then there's one argument after dinner. And then suddenly you have family meetings. Ha ha ha. Uh, shout out to Street Profit TV. He sent one ninety nine. He said, "Can't wait for everything twenty four got for us." FMW f- or none. Yeah. Uh, Nassau underscore HWD sent four ninety nine. He said, "I think one of my favorite clips I didn't see on the vid was Smack talking about how he got banked by a special ed homie." No offense. Laugh out loud. <laughs> 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 That's yeah. his first. Uh, so I'm sorry. That's his tenth super uh, super chat on live stream. So shout out to you, Nesso underscore HWB. That's oh, his damn. tenth time That's what sending that, that. Yeah. Oh shit. Oh. Tenth time sending a super chat. We appreciate you. Uh, shout out to Mike Hoochie's Harry. He sent four ninety nine. He said, "Did Smack ask Scooter for a ride, blood?" Nah, shout out Scooter. His birthday just was a few days ago. He was just a thousand late, Scooter. Yeah, because if you look at uh, Smack uh, Insta story, he shouted out Scooter. Scooter was on there, man. Scooter been around in 50 for so long. All just his walking life, around. 42 years. Yeah, just walking around. Was that was on your Insta story the other day? Yeah, yeah. Like, I love you, Kevin. I think it. Uh-huh. Yeah, just so peaceful. Walk to school, walk home. Like, nobody messed with him. They knew who he was, what he was doing. Oh, he was God. walking from... He was walking from the 40s to the 50s. And the 40s loved him just like yeah, we loved him. They God never disrespected him. They always looked out for him. Shout out to him for looking after my cousin. I don't everything. He's just a neutral young man that, that was coming with the manual arts. Mm-hmm. You feel me? And niggas knew what, where he was at, where he was going, and where he lived. You mm-hmm. feel me? And what he was around, what he was surrounded by. But niggas always looked out for him. Scooter, man, you feel me? Got much love. Love you to death, bro. You feel me? Like... That's one of the niggas that everybody like really, 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 really protect and love. You know what oh, I'm yeah, saying? Oh, yeah, we crazy over Shout there, out dude. to the homie Scooter. Don't worry about nothing. Love you, ass low kid. You know what I mean? Shout out to Humble Schizo. He sent 4 He said, Trail got a soft spot in his heart for dogs. Auntie Story had you choked up about to shed some tears. Fuck them coyotes in the back, bruh. Oh, you and Auntie talked about Coco? No, no, we didn't. But that's crazy that you saying that because I didn't even bring up no dog. But she, we was, we brought up some dog. She like my dog died because I asked her, "Do you got dogs?" She like, "No, I got no dog. My dog died," and she didn't want to talk about it. And she was finna drop a tear. But I looked at her probably with compassion. But I don't look at shit back. I, I never look at my streams back. I don't know how I looked at her, whatever the case may be. But if you notice that, that was crazy because I looked at her because I can, I felt what she was saying because. I had a dog that died, and I was like, <laughs> "He really loved this dog. This I really love this dog too." Because I, really I tried to dog. save save this damn dog life. Because I was, I wanted her to tell her story because she was trying to save her dog life. They put her dog to sleep, then did some shit and woke her dog back up. Mm. Then put her dog back to sleep. 
And she didn't give no more context. After that, she was just like, oh my God, I don't even want to talk about this shit. My mama looking, everybody looking. We don't want to talk about it's, the dog. Because it's like a family member. A dog is like a family a family member. Yeah. But they lie to you. Those animal hospitals are so grimy because they'll lie to you and try to give you hope so you can pay them. Well, well this that particular and vet, then they try he was to, trying to save my dog life because this was 2, 3 in the morning. You got to remember. And then that motherfucking dog... Uh, Hospital right there. They was just trying to charge this four five thousand. Five Nigga, thousand. They looked at my dog. Put my her guts back in her body. Like, but, bitch. But, but they looked at the dog and it was fifty fifty. You feel me? They like. Yeah. You still don't know, but it's gonna be five. I'm like, nigga. Hell no. Wow. Wow. But they five like. Racks. But one nigga could feel me though, cause I'm like, bruh, come on, homie. Like, we got to save a life here, but well, what we, we talking to, about? But we they went gave, to a place down the street. But they gave me that place down the street because that one yeah. nurse gave me that place because when I was looking at I was talking to her, you know how I talk, I started talking to her. And she started, she, she, she whispered, she's like, hey, it's a, uh, it's a nigga down the street. Right, go him, tap him. in. They go take tap credit. in with him, fuck with him. They you take know credit. Me? And he going to do it up. And I'm like, all right, for sure. And I went down there and he fucked with me. And even though he did take credit, I still paid cash though, but it wasn't what they what they was charging. Right, you right, feel right, me? Right, right. But still it was like fifteen hundred or something like that though. You feel me? He said he could fix the, you know, help the dog or whatever. But when we went home, I'm like, damn. All right, we dropped the dog off. Let's just hope for the best. Nigga called me like, all right, the surgery went cool. I'm like, oh cool, we for the we on our way. Mm-hmm. On our way, he called me again. He like, damn. They just got us. And I'm like, damn. They just got us. That's fucked up. No, because they had me. I had to get a fucking credit card because it was like 25. It was crazy. Like 25,000. Something insane. It wasn't no fucking 25. What are you talking about? The price of the, the surgery uh-huh. was like 1800 But you got care credit that That's what cover I got. I got a care credit for card. For like 2500 And like, then I'm I covered it. I'm not giving y'all that much money. They're like, oh, it's fine. You can get on a credit card. That's how I knew it was a scam. Because I'm like, y'all are used to this. Y'all want that credit card company money. Mm. So they're like, get this credit card, whatever. They'll charge you up thinking you have hope to save your dog's life. You don't got no hope. It's over. Yeah, you don't got Christmas. no hope. But when a dog died, that was that was crazy. I had We had to ride home. We had to... Dog was already passed away, but before I shook, the dog was alive. She was looking at me. I'm like, I got you. Like one of the homies. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm he- like, hey, look, I got you. I'm fucking with you on from the paper. I'm talking to her like, I got you. My nigga don't even worry about it. So we go home. We come back. Dog gone. I'm like, fuck. So on the way home, I had to shed a tear for the fucking dog. <laughs> Fuck! I'm like, man, I don't want no more fucking dogs. This shit is out. I don't want no more. Get it's these motherfuckers up out of here. I'm up out of, I'm, I'm up out of here. I don't want no fucking dog. You feel me? Hey, but shout out my brother that's watching. You feel me? My big brother. Not big deal. You feel me? I got a big brother. Shout out my boy. You oh, feel me? Side. You know what I'm saying? We sent my nigga a uh, Christmas card. He said he got the Christmas card. That's burnt <laughs> out. We didn't send the nigga a Christmas card. That's good. <laughs> Hey, all my family got the Christmas card. I love it. We took some uh, family, a uh, wife, little photos. You know what I mean? We took the wife photo and this it's just the Christmas card the out. Wife photos, you yeah. know what I'm saying? We we sent that out. But yeah, um, paper chaser. Did you see Pope walk out on an interview with the other side and cut asking him not to, uh, not being invited to BOF? You feel me? First of all, yeah, I haven't invited my nigga to BOF yet. You feel me? Yes, yes. You really yet. don't gotta explain yourself. Uh, I don't have to explain myself, but I haven't. I haven't invited them yet. But I did interview him already on your platform, bitch. You feel me? And then you're re-interviewing him because niggas just infatuated with gang culture and want you to say something out of pocket. But my niggas is just too like. You know, they just too on point. Like they don't, they not going for none of that. You lucky them niggas didn't beat oh your motherfucking God. ass in there. They held. And I want to salute Pope because he holds himself back, and I want to salute the other homie. You feel me? Because they. Oh my uh, God, man! Shout out to the Because he could have gave the nigga a look. Hey, he was like, hey, hey, when you look, when you seen this, hey, go crazy, huh? Listen, what I swear on the way here, I was if looking they at it. Would have gave each other the signal. They would have fucked you off in that hey, motherfucker. Hey, I was looking. I said, damn, what if one of them niggas just was like, bam. Yeah, yeah, let me out of here. Yeah, we out of here. Look at the nigga like, should we groovy? Oh, God. Oh, God. Like, hey, groove, fuck, man. You ain't crazy, huh? But now your nigga's like, oh, we ain't gonna groove because we gonna shake. You feel me? You feel me? We gonna do all the whole little shit, but 
when I was interviewing niggas like that, I interviewed, and let's just let the record reflect. Anybody that was rapping from Hoover or whatever the case may be, I brought them on that platform and still to have views or whatever. You feel me? Like, shout out my my boy C Poke. He was doing, he, yeah, he's been doing the thing Pope. for a my long nigga. time. He's, you know what I mean? He's one of the niggas that's out here that you can say if you rapping from Hoover, that's a nigga. Oh, yeah, for sure. Fair to say. Oh, God Truth in the details. Truth in the detail, that's a nigga. Shout out my nigga C Poke. I don't, I don't have to bring niggas on here all the time. They doing it up. You feel me? But they will be on here because, you know, that that's just what it is. Shout out my nigga Young Thread too. You feel me? Free Trayway right. too. He gonna be on this motherfucker. Uh, Come on, on home, nigga. On everything. But just the this just when I speak to you and when I talk to you and I fuck with you it's just different and you just you can tell and you can see when that shit happened you feel me like my homies is too sharp we not trying to we not trying to talk about the gang shit and give you the culture you don't know you don't know it. you not going you not going to get it you don't know how deep it is like and you don't give a fuck you feel me like and you don't give a fuck and niggas is willing to Die, go to jail, or hell. Hell, come on. Can't turn mine off. For sure. For this shit, you feel me? You ready to die, go to jail, or go to hell? Because niggas like us is ready for all three. And niggas is like, you know, when you said that, oh, niggas has got the acronyms. They got the SN in front of the whole little thing. Niggas is like, huh? Niggas don't even hear that. We don't even hear the word. I don't even know what that shit is or whatever. If you say that, that's crazy. That's like, nigga, like... And I'm, they held themselves as true professionals in that in that situation. It is a question they could have kept <coughs> kept going, but I would say niggas held themselves as true professionals because they did because they'd be dead or in jail right now. <laughs> Fuck with them if niggas. anybody else or any they was in any situation like that, you done. They did I'm like just, they supposed to because you'd have been in jail for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure. because he would have told. That's what I'm saying. They and did. They had the way you're going to jails. So we're going to bust our groove. <laughs> we out of here. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> hey, pass me the smoke because we yeah. look. Cause, hey, because we can go back and groovy. Right. But nah, it ain't worth it. You did the right thing. Nah, Shout out it's to not Paul. worth it, man. Shout out to the niggas, you feel me? I, I had all them niggas at the table with me. You feel me? I had all them niggas at the table with me. Nine dudes, nine four eight Trey seven four. All that. You all the way to five dudes. Yeah, niggas was asking me why. Huh? Who is that? Why? What? Who is that? Yeah. Now niggas calling niggas. You feel me? Niggas moving backwards, doing what I'm doing. Real. Yeah. Did you read Paper Chaser? If that's what we talking about. <laughs> we going right, right at that nigga. Right, fair, right. fair to say, fuck you, nigga. That's what I'm saying. Fair to say, you's a oh. bitch. Don't worry about it. Uh, stay on drug. You feel me? What is the craziest studio session you ever been in? The craziest studio session I ever been in that always that's going um always uh that fuck with me that I remind that that I remember is uh Pharrell. You feel me? I'm in the studio with Pharrell. Tiger, of course. They making beats, they going crazy. Uh game come in. I'm like, game in this motherfucker game. Like, you in the studio for real? Why you didn't tell me? Like, he hop on the song. Snoop Dogg come in. Snoop Dogg come in. Like, you in for for real just hit me like it's lit. I'm like Snoop Dogg in this motherfucker. I'm just trying to keep my composure now. I'm just all in the corner. You feel me? Snoop see me. He like, he passed the blunt. Like, let's ease this nigga. Because he, you know what I mean? I don't know where he at. Let me see. Yeah, Pass yeah, the yeah, blunt. Yeah. Oh, I'm like, I got a Snoop Dogg blunt. Now I'm going crazy. Boom. I'm like, now I'm jigging with these niggas. Is this all good? You know, Snoop eased it up. Robin Thicke come in. Robin Thicke singing some shit. You know what I'm saying? Game doing a verse for real, doing some shit. I'm like, this shit is crazy. Justin Bieber coming in this motherfucker. I'm like, shut this shit down. I don't need to know. I don't need to do nothing else. I no, experienced sure. everything. No. It's crazy. Hey, we have been in some crazy sessions. Like, I can't crazy. even think of a crazy session right now because I have been in sessions with big time motherfucking niggas. You hear me? Like, when I'm literally like there, it's just like, bro, it's lit right now. Like, sick. For sure. I've been I'm talking Chris, about. I'm with Chris Brown, nigga. Everybody in this motherfucker. You remember? You the one? Yeah. 
Yeah, you the one took me to that session with Chris Brown, Tiger, and Schoolboy Q. You can tell by the way I walk that I got it. It's on my Ooh. Instagram. I went with you, nigga. We was in your Rory, nigga. Right before that, 50 Cent was in there. That's crazy. And he listening to shit. I'm like, this shit is wild. Now, look, you don't remember? You don't remember? I mean, you, you remember that day, right? Remember, I had no, the I root remember. beer soda, and I had Zannies in it. Q like, what you drinking? I'm like, this is uh, bar juice. He like, what's bar juice? I'm like, this Zannies in it. I ain't got no lean. And then that's when Q said, popping Zannies, popping Zannies. Uh, Goddamn, went to her to the earth. Yeah, like, I remember this shit like it was yesterday. Man, no, nah, we've been in some crazy-ass sessions, homie, huh, like. Uh, Nelly then came in a session. Even dude. with Lil Wayne, this is the this is the ones with Lil Wayne and just like Lil Wayne in here. You feel yeah, me? Like man. I got one with Lil Wayne in here, and then Laura London come in here and she come in with her baby, and I'm like, what the fuck? And then everybody leave and my dumb ass didn't leave. I'm just in here and I'm talking to Lauren London. We doing it up. And them niggas like, bro, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> hey, come on. Yo, <laughs> man. Get the fuck man, out. Wrap it, <laughs> wrap it up. And she was in there with Lil Wayne, baby. Yeah. And she got, and okay, then they wow. had to go in there. They was talking and they was doing it up, nigga. Crazy session. But I, I got crazy sessions when it's just like Lil Wayne. Crazy sessions, nigga, where I'm, I'm, I'm going with Birdman and I'm just sitting in and Rick Ross just come in. Nigga, just get a verse in. Nigga, some basketball shorts and a hoodie. Mm. Like, nigga, I'm talking about just... Nah, I got I got some shit, though. Like, I got some shit where niggas is chilling. Shout out Molly Maul. But Molly Maul had niggas at his house going crazy. French <laughs> Montanas and all all type of motherfuckers coming through. My you brother. got me out right now. Saying one that crazy day. one. This is the craziest one. I'm glad, I'm, glad I'm glad I'm saying all this to remind myself. We go to the studio session, and it says, uh, what's that beach this way? What's the beach this way? Malibu? No, no, no. Is it like Ventura? Santa Barbara. Mm -hmm. Santa Barbara. We go to Santa Barbara, right? I go to Santa Barbara with T-Raw, homies. Kanye having session. It, it, this nigga, he don't want to bring me, though, cuz. I'm like, hey, look, you already know what's the deal. I am a Kanye fan, bitch. You are bringing me to this session. Yeah. I know he probably like, this nigga probably going to embarrass me good because he get up. You feel me? He be talking a lot. He might say some wild shit. He's stupid. Yeah. But I'm like, bro, I swear, I promise you. I ain't going to do nothing. shit. I'm doing my I'm best like, I'm not, I just want to see I got to be in there, please. So he take me. He like, all right, cool. We go in there. Boom. They got the session going, nigga. In the house. They rented out a house. And they got the session going. I see Mike Dean going. I'm like, who the fuck is that? That's Mike Dean going, blowing. I'm sitting off to the side, right? Yeah. I ain't saying nothing. You know what? I'm just I'm just people watching. I'm sitting off to the side. Mike Dean going, Kanye going, nigga T-Raw going. Nigga, this is nigga that walked down the stairs. This is nigga. He walked down the stairs with his computer. He ain't on yet, though. Right. You feel me? He, 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 he go, he, he told Kanye, I got some beats, listen to him. Kanye like, oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. I, I, I like this one. It was Travis Scott. I'm like, who the fuck was that nigga when we left? He was like, oh, this is his artist. His name is Travis Scott. And he went back upstairs, went back in his little lab, and he was doing it. You feel me? Right, Before right. he was even a hot or whatever right, the right. case may be. So I'm, they doing it up or whatever. And this nigga Kanye, they they stopped the music. This nigga Kanye started looking at shoes. He started looking at LeBrons and all the whole little shit. All these basketball nigga shoes and comparing them to what he finna do. He like, and he looked back. He was like, hey. Because, you know, I'm not in the conversation. They in the conversation. He right, like, right. hey, homie, uh, you back there. He pointed at me. I'm the only nigga back here. You like these shoes? They over there like, oh, them, them shoes is cool. Them shoes is cool. I'm like, nigga, hell no. So already when I say that, because I'm on my phone and I just look up, nigga, ask me a question. I just react fast because that's just who I am. Right, and right, look, right. And I looked at the screen. I'm like, nigga, hell no. <laughs> See, Ross looked at me like, fuck. <laughs> this here, this nigga go, right? <laughs> and the nigga coming here was like, See, I told y'all, niggas. Nigga, these motherfuckers trash. Like, he, like he was fucking with me, right? right? So, boom, I left. I left the studio because I was hungry. I went to In and Out. Went to In and Out. Came back. Boom. Went to In and Out, nigga. Them niggas was still doing their thing. I'm sitting far left. I'm eating. Like, I don't fuck what y'all doing. 
Y'all don't know if y'all hungry or not. So I ain't finna say nothing. I ain't finna interrupt y'all shit. So I ain't ask y'all if y'all want nothing. Right. So I'm eating my in and out. Kanye look like. Yeah, in and out. He got me <laughs> fucked up, right? He kept looking back like I'm like, fuck this nigga wants some. So they doing this shit. He act like he finna like, you know, go to the bathroom, go to the kitchen or something. He walked past me and then he just got some of my fries like yeah, I mean, you bitch ass so. nigga. Yeah. <laughs> you know, that's how he did you, bro. He didn't say, Can I have none? He said, Bitch ass nigga, I'm coming to yeah. give me some fries, nigga. Yeah, yeah. Nigga, he like, Fuck with me. Yeah. And I'll he fuck with you. Yeah, I'll yeah, fuck, fuck with, you. with you, nigga, but, but give, give me these fries, fries though. <laughs> oh, God. Most memorable. Most, look, studio session crazy. Studio nah, session hey, was crazy, Kanye, bro. Everything. Hey, hey I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a real short, but Kanye, a real ass nigga. You know he came to the that part video shoot in the Maybach by itself. Cold nigga. You hear me? When we was in that house, that big ass house, and they was walking through throwing the Chinese food. He pulled up by himself, my nigga. I was really chopping game with him. He's really a cooler, down to earth dude, though. For sure. Man, yeah, that was, was some crazy moments, man. I got some more moments, but you know what I mean? I, I had to you know, tell y'all a few to make those ones come true. I mean, well, make those ones come to light up because I be forgetting shit a lot. Uh, Title this Kanye. Mark this nigga to real. <laughs> he you going to give me some fries, bitch, but you my little nigga now. Yeah. <laughs> oh, everything. We got a couple more. Read a couple more super chats before we, um, we do this giveaway, man. Clinton 499 said, love y'all to death, but y'all got to search research stuff before y'all talk. God man, damn. Man, fuck you, bitch. I think it's maybe the Gypsy nigga. Rose situation. I don't know. <laughs> some shit you, you can't know every topic, nigga. Right. Every, every time y'all niggas be talking about that, like, how the fuck am I supposed to do every topic, nigga? I might not even cover shit that's really on my topics. You feel? I might remember some shit that's not even on my sheet or shit I can't even remember because I do got a sheet right here whatever the case may be that, that'll detail it for me and I'll go over it but sometimes I don't know but we gonna bring it up. I'm gonna make y'all help him. We gonna talk about it and give me uh, we gonna give you our perspective on it, bitch. Right. So nigga, fuck you, nigga. Yeah. Shout out to Counting Jeffrey. He's in 499. He said it's a whole show on Hulu about her story miniseries uh, referring to Gypsy Rose. Uh, a Abraham Brima sent 10 euros his first super chat, super chat. He said he was smoking sea crack on everything. I'm so glad for this show. AD underscore. Oh, where'd it go? Where'd it go? Up more. Damn. Yeah. Uh, no, up more. Uh, hell no. Was it up more? Hey, uh, I haven't read oh, it. There oh, there go. it goes. AD underscore 80s underscore sent $2. He said, get Cat Williams on BOF expeditiously. For sure. He's going to kill <laughs> smack I would ass. Just yes, like Charleston oh, going to kill you, bitch. What the fuck you talking about? Me and Charleston going to go at you. You're not. You, you, you can't, like Charleston I said, is at. You ain't got nothing. We going to see where Charleston is oh, at. We know where he at. Fuck we going to see where you at. Fuck him. He ain't gonna. He ain't. Hey, look. He ain't never met a nigga that's gonna say no shit like that. He met everybody. No, 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 no,
Oh, that shit is just like, like stop putting the list out, man. This nigga been too deep in there too long. Like, what is it? What is what's going on, homie? Like this, the list is just trash. Like the list really is trash. See. Like this shit is yeah. Like come on, man. Like I don't even want to. Like some shit is just like crazy. Like it's just. It just be a topic. It just be a headline, and it's just trash. Like I seen Whoopi Goldberg. Like bitch, I ain't on no motherfucking list, bitch. Cause they had her on the list. Yeah. And she mm. like, nigga, huh? Like I don't even go nowhere. Y'all saying I anything? Mean, right. Well, let me let's address it, cause you niggas want the headline. Right, right. Even though I'm on the list, does that make me guilty? No. You don't know if I've ever been there. You don't know if I've ever flew to the island. You don't even know partaking okay, into list, it. The list the- is you were on the jet. Oh, you went. You went. You oh. took your ass over there. That's oh, the list. Okay, so we know who came and, and went. So, but if so you why went, the fuck were you over there then, bitch? But she said that list was fake, which it was, and mm. she wasn't was over it? there, and she explained it. Yeah, mm. it's okay. trash. Like, well, for what? Niggas is going to make it? I can make I a list right now. List. I can, Yeah, I can make a list right now. You feel me? And, and do it up. Like, fuck that shit. They like, put all the higher ups on there? Or what? Oh, yeah. It's great that Beyonce <laughs> on there, Jay-Z on there. Uh, <laughs> Yeah, Chris Tucker on there. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's, it's uh, going up. I mean, it's going up. Mike who cheesy Harry sent five dollars. He said money. Mike Cat finna put paws on you. Smack. Yeah, all right, right, <laughs> right again, nigga. Come sit down on back on feed and talk your shit, nigga. Cause I got the truth and the details, Ooh. motherfucker. Yeah, come to back on fit, Cat. I ain't worried about it. That's his third super chat. Shout out to you, Mike who cheesy Harry. Uh, Cruz three one zero K said he sent ten dollars. He said what's good from the three one zero. Love your guys' videos. Keep up the great work. Guys' videos. Keep up the great work. Wait, what? <laughs> Thank you. Shout out to him. Shout out That's to his you, first boy. super chat, so shout out to you. Khalil Supreme sent $5. He said, Heather making me want a minimal sweater right now. Super icy. Oh, yeah. Shout out to minimal. This is where my sweater's from. Fitche! Yeah, yeah, they made fit check. Yeah, they made So, what you got? my sweater is from minimal. My jeans are like vintage from a thrift store. My shoes are from Uggs. And yeah, that's my outfit. But yeah, the minimal sweater is so cute. It feels so good too. It's like heavy, but not heavy. It's like lightweight. It has stars. It's pink. It's cute. Yeah. yeah shout man. out to my fit. Feel me? Shout out to the shout out. You want to do a fit check? Yeah, I'm fit check. Yeah, I'm, okay, I'm, like, I'm minimal down. I'm going to yeah, do one. Minimal yeah, minimal down. I'm pink minimal down. Yeah, you know what I mean? Sure. Sweater. You feel me? Pants. Uh-huh. You feel me? Crop tee. Okay. If I take this off, you feel me? Yeah, big minimal down. Hood going on. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Come on, man. Pants is fly. I ain't got on no shoes because I'm relaxed and I just took my shoes off. But As you should. You know what I mean? Got the morning joints with the hat on. Y'all already know what's, what's up. What's that the brand denim called tears. again? Denim get tears. Get the denim tears hat. You know what I mean? Y'all know what's up. I had to get this motherfucker to cop it. I don't cop the jeans, the whole outfit, but I, you know what I'm and saying? I'm motherfucker getting saucy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. What you got? What you got? Uh, let's see. Uh, shout out my brother Jay Real. You feel me? Bought me the hoodie. You feel me? But my shirt minimum. You I feel me? You. My pants is minimum. And y'all know how I do. I wish I could do it, but I can't right now. With the Air Forces. You hear me? I'm just real regular right now. You know hear I me? Mean? But shout out minimum, man. They keep me dipped in butter, man. You Same. understand me? Shout out to minimum. Elijah Robinson sent 199. He said, "My girl does nails. How do I tap in? How do I tap in with your product? Oh, my girl does nails. How do I tap in with your product? You can uh, tap in with us on moneyfornails.com or on Instagram at Money for Nails, and you can see all of our products. If you DM me, I would be happy to send her out a package too. I'm in the mood to give stuff away. It's a new year. We need new customers, new eyes on us. So I would love to send her out a package so that she can use it on her clients, her friends, family, whatever." Um, Bone E Slave sent one ninety nine. He said, "What y'all think about Pokey walking out on the homie?" We read that already. Oh yeah, read that already. Go, do the thing. Uh, bring it down some, or yeah, bring it like up. What? Make sure oh, y'all yeah. like this video, man, down. for real. Yeah, make sure you like this video. Tiny Cuz, oh, o- O'Shea Beats in two dollars. He said, "Tiny Cuz, talk about when you was gonna fade Mike Epps." Uh, I don't know about that. Cranium View sent one ninety nine. He said, "Yo, y'all would be fire if y'all weren't mid." Okay. If we thanks. weren't what? If we weren't mid. What that mean? Like mild. Uh, like whatever. we'd be fire if we wasn't. We'd be super hot if we weren't mid. Uh, whatever you say. Uh, Gaza Bigo sent one ninety nine. He said, "We need story times with trail solo videos." That's a good vlog. Yeah, we could do that. 
Uh, Johnny L. Cash, fifteen cent, five dollars. He said, "Hey, Charles Smackwater, was Pun wearing Traffic's jean yesterday night on Community? Hmm? Traffic's jeans yesterday night on Community?" Oh, he's saying a joke, man. Man, bitch, he can't fit that. Nigga. Right, right. He's, he's, yeah. yeah, he can't fit that nigga. Sharon, oh, cool. Sharon oh, last super chat. Sharon said one, or sorry, four ninety nine. She said, "Will y'all interview a GPS artist like Saucy Santana? I think that would be dope." Yeah, I would. I, would. I don't got nothing against them. No, whatever they preference is, is they preference. What if he hug you though? Oh? No, I'm just. He can hug. He can hug. No, we can't do it. No, that's what it. Hold up, baby, that's going on. <laughs> Why they gotta, gotta go crazy though like that? Like, come I mean, on, we gonna keep it cool. No, that's how they love it. Okay, my love is different. So that <laughs> <laughs> De La Soul Tequila then dropped off some gifts for us, man. Shout out to homie Troy. Shout out Iris, man, for uh, sending that to us, man. Open appreciate it up, man. You, appreciate Open it up, you. Appreciate you. Appreciate you. It's Got beautiful. Are we going to take a shot? Yeah, I mean, we Look at this, y'all. Good. It came with a note and everything, you know what I mean? <laughs> Telling us it came from them. Shout out to them. You feel me? This is uh-huh. a beautiful drink right here. You can. It looks beautiful, though. I ain't going to lie to you. I can't wait to taste it to see what's going they on said, with it. They said, enjoy being lit. I'm back on Fig, Garrison and Troy. Uh-huh, let's get to that. Come let's on. Get to Look that, how they said it to let's us. Three lit. of all kinds. Take one of the motherfuckers out, though, man, so we can take a shot. All right, well, I'm going to keep it real with you. Tequila I me. Oh, oh, yeah, we're gonna do the brown one. Let's do Tequila that. me. Let's do this one. We're gonna do the brown. Ooh. Yeah, Rapasado. Raza. Raza, Holmes. It's a new thing. Raza. Yeah, Rapasado. What's this? Me and me. Mendeo. Oh, are they. Coasters? Yeah, shouts out to the shout out. Shouts out to the shout out, man. I'll see huh? y'all one time. Of course. But yeah, we're gonna, gonna uh, we gonna do some giveaways, you know what I mean? Hey, we're we gonna, gonna wrap this up giveaways. right here. Travis Scott signed nah, it personally himself. Hey, 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 yeah, Travis Scott signed it first. We're gonna put my motherfucking Rishi Punch. Girl, never rap on that. Hey, I knew he was gonna go crazy. We're going to raffle that off. Travis got signed to this self personnel. Okay, so yeah, people are drinking right now Casa de la Sol. Yeah, Casa de la so if Sol. So if it's in the near liquor store where y'all at, make sure y'all tap in and go get that drink, man. Uh, send, uh where is it at again? You it's in me? Total Wine. Total Wine and what was the other one? BevMo. BevMo. Bev you know what I mean? Make sure y'all go to Total Wine. Make sure y'all go to any BevMo in the world. You feel me? Make sure y'all go cop that uh, Casa de la Sol. Casa de la Sol. Troca. Troca. <laughs> Cheers. Hey, cheers to 2024. We finna do better and be better. We trying to last, not come in last. Yeah. Back on big. Whoa. Love y'all. We trying to last, not come in last. Bitch, you heard him. Mm-hmm. Ah. Did you drink all yours? I don't care. I sure the fuck did I not. know you's I a bitch. I just drank. <laughs> Shout out to y'all, yeah, man. Shout out to shout out. Do we know you did that? Cause you used to smoke crack. No, bitch, don't put that in there. You trying to get tired of that? No, you up. was with the nigga. You was smoking crack. I was selling this shit to the nigga. <laughs> I, I wasn't doing none of that, nigga. Cat got a good memory. Smoking crack or not? Right. He know exactly who did it. What you need? There you go. <laughs> Whoa. Hey, you know how they put it in there. Hey. There you go. Real yeah. tequila drinkers. I see you, my boy. Yes, sir. We in here it's doing it It's actually good. It tastes like Casamigos. Nah, that was good. It was tastes like Ooh, that. was all Super Chat. Better than Casamigos. You know what I mean? That was all Super Chat. So, you feel that me? That was all Super Chat. That's all the Super Chat. People been complaining about that shit. Yeah, no, we read all the Super Chats, but we going to do some giveaways right now, man. But Hold on. Let me go pee real quick. Go ahead. Hurry up. Hurry up. Hurry up, man. Ah. You know what I'm saying? It. Get your crutches. Because they were laughing at that one time when we was over here laughing and joking. Oh, they love like you, you did the crutches and you walked and somebody you can't do it. Look, you finna do it right now. <laughs> so I cook, you gotta be hot. <laughs> look at that nigga, look. <laughs> oh, you oh, 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 Look at that nigga, look at piece of his foot up. Nasty. Ugh. Oh, fuck. Oh, 
Man, shout out to everybody right now, man, in the chat. Make sure y'all like this video. Let me see how many likes we got, man, before we get to these giveaways. Um, pull out some of the um, shrooms we got for um, from um, Mr. Mushies, because we're going to be giving away a lot of that, too. Um, I'm definitely going to give away some of my orange dream sickles. I got some. Make sure we ain't even got 200, um, 2,000 likes. We definitely need 2,000, man. Let's do this shit before we uh, start doing these giveaways. I mean, we just uh, have so many. Yeah, we got to show the flavors. We got flavors. So we have strawberry shortcake right here from Mr. Mushy that we're going to be giving away. Big we have please. a pumpkin spice pretzel that is really good for the holidays that we're going to be giving away. We have the ube, u, ube donut. I don't know. I've never tried this flavor, but I'm sure it's great. Two of those. We have a back on fig. Look, I just randomly pick and look, we have a back on fig orange dream sickle. The best bar that Mr. Mushies has to offer. It tastes so good. We made sure that this tastes so good, like choc orange chocolate, right? Make sure you guys check this out on Mr. Mushies. Make sure you put your order in for the orange dream sickle because it is everything. And then we have the Jedi Mint, which I'm sure is great because I love mint. So basically this is like a chocolate mint bar. What's our Mr. Mushy code? B B O F fifteen. B O F fifteen. So we're gonna leave these here because we're gonna be giving these away. This is one, two, three, four, five, six. Six Mr. Mushy bars that we're gonna be giving away during today's stream. Do they have to do anything special or how Yes, they gotta do something special, man. Y'all y'all definitely do y'all definitely gotta do something special today, man. Prize picks giveaway. This is a part of our prize picks giveaway. We are giving away a free shirt with all our first time depositors. All you have to do is follow these steps, which will be posted on BOF Instagram, which is posted now that you can go check out. Uh, download prize picks and use code BOF when you deposit $5 and up. Take a screenshot of your prize picks wallet, then show the money you deposited and the free money that you get when you use code BOF. Send the screenshots to BOFPicks at gmail.com. This is where you have to go right at. You can do all that, download prize picks, you know, uh, make sure you do your $5 deposit, take screenshots, but you have to send it to BOFPicks at gmail.com along with the email that you use for your prize picks accounts and you will be qualified for the giveaway. We are giving away six Mr. Mushy's bar right now. He has slippers behind us. We have t-shirts behind us we have all kind of stuff that we are giving away so make sure you email all of that info to bofpicks at gmail.com and hopefully you will be picked for today's giveaway um along with the email that you use for prize picks we will verify that you are the first time depositor and send you a link to get you free shirts let's get What's that free shirt man free shirts free shoes today free goodies Keychains, you know what I mean? Everything in this box, you feel me? Delta Munchies, Is this a me? free shirt? Imperio. Yeah, that's a free shirt. This is All a right, free I mean, shirt. Some of y'all fat, so that's a 2X. A two a two Cause I know some of y'all some big niggas like For doing sure, yeah. You know what I mean? But Shout make sure y'all hit that email. That's the only way we gonna know that you did it. Man, BOFPicks at gmail.com. You bit. You bit. So let's see what you got going on. I mean, go do that, man. Be your first time depositor, man. You can just deposit the five bucks, man, and we got you. Don't worry about it, man. You know what I mean? Mm. Go ahead and do that, man. But while you're doing that, make sure you like the video. Make sure you like the video. I'm going to be giving away all of this shit, too. Then I'm going to just start giving away bigger shit, too. Hey, Computers, PS5s, cameras, hey, Terrell, all the type, all all that type shit. Yeah. So uh, the chair, I forgot who broke it. It don't even matter. Remember they, they put their arm on it, bro. Yeah. Can give me that. Give me that so I can take it and put that on it. <laughs> I'm gonna get a million <laughs> Let me get that chair so I can put it on my little shit. Yeah, that's me. Oh, it's the deep pot. The deep pot. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get paid. You know what I mean? We want some chairs. That you know what I mean? Famous people been in the chairs. It's a back old fig chair. He wanna put hey, it on deep so pot. We we're gonna put that on deep pot. We're gonna put it. We're gonna split. Hey, hey, yeah. They gonna want that chair. They gonna weld that shit back together. <laughs> they be like, this is the back on fed chair right here. Yeah, man. If you just came in, this motherfucker like the video. If you just came in, you want some man giveaway. Make sure you go to um go to your app store, download Prize Pick. You feel me? You can deposit five bucks. It don't even matter. Use my code B O F to double your deposit up to a hundred dollars or whatever the case may be. Go to um. Our email, bofpigs uh, at gmail.com. Show everybody, show sh screenshot that you did it, you feel me? 
And boom, you feel me? There you go. You enter, and we gonna give you give away something. Don't worry about nothing. We got it for you. Everybody been wanting these goddamn bars, so we gonna give them away. Cause these please take this. it easy, y'all. Please, goddamn expensive. please. I don't give a fuck they? how expensive they are. Hell Just yeah. don't take the whole bar. How in the name of Jesus. Right you gonna think you to real feeling like you God? Nigga, I thought I was on another planet. It's they expensive, but it's worth it. I know, because that's what you see what he's saying. I'm telling y'all the truth. Is he I, a crackhead? You a crackhead too, bitch. We was hungry that day. We didn't know that shit was going to do that. We was really starving that day, nigga. And yeah, it yeah. was in Mexico. Nigga, we like, fuck it. I'm like, shit, well, let's get high then. We nigga. like, no, well, I wasn't even about getting high. I'm like, ooh, this chocolate good. No, no, no. I'm, what I'm saying, I'm like, now, we, you know, we started off with, let's just get high. Let's pop a minimal. Now we taste it. We like, shit, well, we just kind of hungry. Let's go to kill this bar off now we yeah. in there he talking about hey. god homie okay we got some giveaways <laughs> right now man hold on let me let me ask my boy is this the shit let me see let me see them the names that won let me see y'all what should I do for my birthday I'm so confused my birthday is like 20 days away what you gonna do I don't know wow well, for sure, we gotta go out to eat somewhere. Just I was gonna say, there. should I have a dinner party? Should I have a house party? Should I have? Oh, have a house party. We're going up. Right. We're going platinum then. What? Hell yeah. What? We ain't gotta worry about nothing. We here at the house just ah, yeah. all your good friends, all your good peoples. It's gonna be a movie. For right. Sure. Have food. It's going okay. Up. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Okay. That's it. Yeah, we got some people. My boy Brian. Okay, here. We gonna we gonna get my we gonna let my girl uh, read the names off. off. Lerana Ma. Bryson McKitchen. Come on, Bryson McKitchen. Kuda Bang. Shout out to Kuda Bang. Kevo Knox and Julian Jackson. Those are our giveaway winners. They all submitted their prize. Downloaded prize picks, submitted their $5, submitted their picks, and submitted right. their yeah, email to BOF at prizepicks.com. <laughs> so shout out to all of y'all. Shout out to the winner. Oh, shit. What was that? The big ass sign. Damn. Yeah. Um, three more just sent. Shout out to Joseph Blue. Shout out to Danny Alvarado. And I'm about to have brain surgery. Shout out to you. Shout out to Destiny Caller. All of them just sent um, their prize picks, giveaway, submissions. So shout out to y'all. You know who that was, right, T-Rip? Who? We, we have a lot to give away. We talked to him yesterday. He was having brain surgery. Hey, look. At, at the, at the Shame On You podcast. That's nine people to give away to. Hey, look. At the Shame On You podcast. Your ass better be having brain surgery because that's your third time telling me that, okay? Is it? Your mama and your daddy, I need to know when the date when you're having brain surgery. Who? I need to know when you're having this damn surgery, okay? So I can know that you keep telling me this, that it's uh, accurate. All right? So, <laughs> if you keep telling me that you don't have no damn surgery, and you making me feel sorry for you, nigga, and you ain't actually have no surgery, I'm going to find your ass. And bank you. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, we got shit going. You know what I mean? We got house shoes going. All those kids, man, where my phone at? Let me make sure he may, um, he get their sizes and shit so we can get it going. Make sure y'all like this video while we doing that. You understand me? Mm -hmm. First video of 2024 on a Friday with the original hostess of Back on Fig. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Fair to say. Fair to say. And I ain't even loaded, y'all. I'm having a great time. Like, I see they want to pay I'm me loaded. to be loaded so bad. Hey, look. Terrell, Terrell, hey, look. No, no. They really want to pay me to be loaded. I'm like, I'm cooling. I'm just happy. We like, haven't seen like, it. Like, last year, okay, I was loaded. This year, I'm just cooling. <laughs> <laughs> it's five days in. He talking that shit, bitch. We got 360 more to go. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go to 20 people. You know what I'm saying? I told six to cut it off at 20 people. I can at least send at least 20 of y'all one thing. Thank you for everybody that's uh, tuning in with us. And uh, make sure you download that prize pick act because you never know what you can get. You never know what you can do. Even if you downloaded it one time, you could definitely use another email. And uh, download it again, make down if and deposit five bucks. But make sure you just stay aware of our giveaways. Hold on, stay aware, you know what I'm saying? Make sure you, the giveaways is coming. But we got stuff, you feel me? I'm gonna stop it at 20 people, man. We got a few people already, man. But thank you. It's a lot of y'all already. He's sending me the list, but we got some shit going in here, man. Appreciate it. I got all, all the type of shit I can give away in this bitch, man. God, right. hey. Very if he giving me stuff away, I'll be like, God, dang. You know what I mean? Hey, it's up all in these boxes. 
But we gonna put them back in the box and eat for y'all. We gonna ship it when we gonna do it, man. And shout out to Minimum. They sent me another care package, man. Yeah, you gotta be right. Yeah. I'm gonna be able to the clubhouse here to be like this tonight, you hear me? <laughs> I ain't bullshit. Hey, the pants, hey, it's cold. I'm gonna be in a motherfucker like this. All shingles, yes, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had cowboy boots to put on with this motherfucker right here. If I had the cowboy boots, I would be crazy. What shoe you wear? Man, that nigga, he overrated. Them motherfuckers are like 2000. I don't even want to be in the motherfucker with the silver he did train the on the most. He, yeah, yeah, yeah. I Buying remember them. Shoes. I'm not. You Boy. remember when you bought them? We want he won to the BT uh-huh, Awards. Uh-huh. When we went to the BT Awards, uh-huh. he's stepping out like he just cowboy. You What's going saying? on? What's going on? Make sure you do it up, man. Shout out uh Slick Amuni TV. He said boring. Yeah, your mama's boring. Bitch. <laughs> yeah, and your oh, daddy, wow. bitch. Now we just spiced it up. Show show that to your mama. Right, right. Mama, said. they talked about. It. They said you boring and daddy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Go show right, that to your right. mama. Tell her I said you boring. Right. Shut your fuck your mama. Look. Dude, she gonna be like, oh, nigga, this shit crazy. What you watching? Right. She gonna be like, <laughs> it's called Back on Fig. Back on Fig. Ain't that where the prostitutes be? Yeah. <laughs> man, shout out. We got some stuff coming, man. But Back on Fig, man. We got some nice little stuff coming, man. Uh, recording more vlogs, doing some stuff. We got some shit coming in the mix, man. Uh, shout out Heather, too. She got some stuff coming on her channel. She got a cooking, cooking show with uh, Bianca that's coming up. Yeah, uh, she just can't wait a, for the first episode to drop. Yeah, can't wait for that, man. We got to get her booked, though, with some interviews. We got to get that uh, down packed. Next week, we're going to start booking for her interviews. I'm scared. Um, what you scared for? Get that Luther Lufe. Shout out the nigga that just booked me for an interview. You hear me? Hey, 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 hey bullshit. Niggas that don't even know how to do this shit. He said the front, front end, end, and then the day of, he going to send it back in. I'm like, damn, yeah. if you want to book me for the 14th, and you sent me this? I'm like, shout out to you. I would yeah. be there I mean, on time. I'm not paying anybody. Man, shout out to you. I will be hey, there. Hey, I'm gonna be in a Discord like this. Hey, what's that? What's going on? Ask me what you want, to, bitch. What's yeah. Crack it. For yeah. real, man. Yeah, Lady SB in the building. You feel me? Man, shout out Lady SB. On Heather's shit. Man, make sure y'all they subscribe to her channel. They love Lady SB. Yeah, well, Lady they love SB her. Is, she, is she from Chicago? Philly. She's from Philly. Philly, I mean, yeah. yeah she really fool. like she, she a fool. She is a fool. She a fool, huh? I real life The fool. first day she did that podcast with us, hey, she was like this. So what's happening? I'm like... That, that's me. I, I love that ain't SB white. Remember I told you that? that ain't her. She like this legend. In the the hell hell is? Is? I'm like, bro, she don't talk like that. I know her from just being quiet. Hey, hey. I'm like, she she's a real Philly motherfucker. Like, like, shout out to her. Hey, she get on camera. She came a long way. Yeah, yeah. She, she came is. a long way. She like, nigga, what's happening? Niggas so get on camera. I'm trying to get her different. into like the TikTok vibe, the content vibe, because she's just like stuck on Instagram, which is fine. All of us are. She ain't even really on Instagram. She's not really. She's just. Not on the internet, really. So I'm trying to bring her into the internet world. You know, some people that just are not on the internet world. I'm trying to bring her into the content space, internet world. So we we filmed one vlog. Trevor said it'll be done next week. They what do you want? I see hella thick. Give me a coat. And we're supposed to be vlogging again this month. And yeah, she's just funny. I posted a TikTok and her they vibe. saw her like in a reflection of my refrigerator and they're like, oh, Bianca, Bianca. Because I was like, oh, my friend that doesn't TikTok said that I was having a seizure because I did like a certain TikTok and they all knew it was her. And she was like, last night we were at dinner and she's like, oh, I need to like get on there because I saw everybody was saying like, oh, that's Bianca. Like, she oh, where's she some at? Attention. Yeah. <laughs> she was like, oh, maybe I should jump on there. <laughs> Nah, I'm shout like, out to yeah, her on the real. Shout, shout out to her. her, man. She getting some love, love attention. Sure. Her energy, like, I, to real, didn't I tell you this? I'm like, bro, I've been around her for years, no, but good. she she was always, like, quiet. You feel me? I done been to the house, to the SB parties, but she quiet. She came on back on feet. It was like, nah, nah. I said, you sure that's SB wife right there? Is that her? Because, like, this Quiet. Ain't... Right, She's like, never quiet. Man, shit, she lying to me. She, she fooled me. She must have been mad. The she only know. time... Listen, I done been around her numerous of times at the house yeah. where SB had a party. It was his birthday mm-hmm. or whatever. Nigga, I was there. And she just, hey, 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 hey. So when she came on here, she just, nigga! Man, these niggas in the chat crazy. They just worried about the ass. Oh, yeah, they terrible. God she bless you. She has a cute-ass ass body. Make sure y'all check out for that on our cooking show. <laughs> Make sure you uh, check nah, us out. <laughs> don't do that. You feel me? We ain't checking out. Just, we checking out the cooking, man. Yeah, well, yeah. We checking out the cooking, some man. People, don't do some people. Some people are trying it. to look. Don't do it. But they gonna look anyway. You know what I'm saying? Y'all women, they gonna look anyway. 
They y'all gonna look anyway. They said I need a wife like Bianca. She is like a super wife. For sure. Yeah, she be doing it up, man. Shout out her, man. You know what I mean? But again, man, we got people in here. Make sure y'all like this video. Y'all got me fucked up today, mm -hmm. man. Y'all got me real messed up today. 2,000 likes. I need them. Here we man, go. we need all them bust a bag of chips, you bitch. Make sure y'all like this. But it don't cost a dime for you to just press the exit. Because right now on their phones, I know what they looking at. It's showing all the chat. If you press X right now, exit out the chat, and then press more? the like button. All you got to do is press comments, and oh. you back to where you was at. Like, come on, man. Like, come on. We giving y'all some knowledge you can't learn in college. Some news you can use, you won't refuse, and you may not want to abuse. Like, come on. Fuck with us, because we fuck with y'all. So, nigga, don't play with yeah. us. Nigga, don't, don't cheat us. Treat us. Nigga, that's all we saying. Like, come on, bro. It don't cost a dime. Why are you giving these niggas this pimp talk? Because I got to. That's the only way they understand. You understand me? Are that's you, the only, they that's the only way. They so hoes? They think so hoes? Oh, yeah. They some hoes. They talk about me, so they some hoes, nigga. They call me rats and everything. Else. Bitch ass, nigga. So like this video, nigga, for me even commenting back to y'all comments, nigga. Get that nigga some rats, y'all. That nigga's a Man, rat. That nigga told on Cat that nigga told on that nigga. He know he hey. told a true story, Cat Williams. You gotta come defend yourself. Come nigga defend was yourself. On, he was on 59th and Denver. He said he was. Uh, he on was a one way like this. Yeah. With a yeah. big pookie pipe. Yeah. I ain't bullshitting. I ain't bullshitting with wow. you. Wow, he gonna he gonna have to get that story together. Like this video right now and go tag that nigga Cat Williams on his Instagram, his Twitter. All I want y'all to do on every fucking uh, national network that he got, tag back on Fed Terrell, S Mac and Heather. They tripping. You need to go see what's up. Hey, hey, put the link in there. Like you need to go see what's up. Tell him come holler. Yeah, tell him come holler, man. I can I can really have a conversation with Cat Williams because we come from that same shit. You feel me? Pimping and pandering, you hear me? All he, this. He wasn't a real pimp. Though, right? Yes, he was. Yes, he was. Everybody, hey, he was a nigga before this uh stand up comedian. Right, so you telling him? You telling again? <laughs> Cause y'all already <laughs> put the rat. You bitch ass nigga. That's why I say it's favoritism, cuz you again. niggas do whatever Terrell say. Whoa, y'all do whatever he say. You didn't ask Quit to do dick it. Ride, nigga. Pause. Whoa, Quit so dick ride, dick nigga. Riding. Yes. Quit dick riding. Way nigga. more rats in the chat. Hey. He, they, if you, y'all, y'all, it's all his bitches. I, I swear. I, oh, they're not they my oh, bitches. Yeah, they your bitches. They, your, they my bitches. They your pink panty funky cock jingle bells on the fur bitches, nigga. Whoa, no. So they, when you they, say put the rest down, they want to flood it. No, they love you. They, they okay, say, hey, nigga, back hey, on TV. Okay, let's see. Let's see. They don't love you. They don't love you. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's see. Put the fuck you fingers for Terrell. Let's see. Put the fuck you fingers. <laughs> rats are fucking fingers. Put the, put Let's the see. fuck you fingers for Terrell. Let's if, see. Hey, if you fuck with Terrell, put the rats. If you fuck with me, put the fuck you fingers. Let's see. <laughs> That's the poll. Watch this. We gonna get to the bottom line. Watch this. We gonna sit and wait. What we gonna do? I'm you know, If y'all watching right now, <laughs> we, watch, we live in the chat. Gophers, <laughs> pills, needles. <laughs> Rats, rats, rats. Wow. Rats, rats, Whoa. rats. Whoa. Yeah. That's a rat? Okay. Yeah. Yeah, all right. Yeah, let the record reflect. No. Let's get to that. Yeah. Oh, oh, mouse. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So we ain't got no fuck you for yeah. Like I said, they oh, came to you. Yeah. They came to you, bro. One. You the man. They tell them the truth. Hold up. One, two, fuck you one, two, two, fuck you fingers. Okay. One, two. They that's the, right. They put the rat with the foot in the emoji like, y'all, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> At three. Three, but four, that, like, nah, it's over. I, they, they cater to you. We know that. Like right. I said, like I said, I'm going to come to you, so I expect you to look up to you. No, 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 Bro, <laughs> don't change it now. I'm not changing. You when you told me, we're going to start back on fig. We ain't getting a dog. you're a big dog now. Now I am. <laughs> I hate this nigga. Look, look at all them rats. Like, look at all them oranges. Like, yeah. You the nigga. No, no, no. You the nigga. Ah, uh, no, you no, no. The chat tells the truth, so we you don't get distracted. Uh, you know what was super funny? We was talking crazy, nigga. We was on the news and, uh... Uh, auntie was like, yeah, put the pepperonis in the, in the chat. They flooded that motherfucker. No, they did not. I swear to God, they did. No, they did was not. That, I was looking at the chat. Listen, when y'all said it was only two or three, that motherfucker looked it just like the rest. I swear to God, I swear to God, I watched that, Terrell. I swear to God. So they had pepperonis in the they chat? They had hella pepperonis in the chat. When I was looking at it, they just yes, had, they was yeah, it was delayed on your end, but hey, they had hella pepperoni. <laughs> I, I watched it. I Wait, watched it. Wait, what's the pepperoni for? Y'all talking about Mark Nasty What's the pepperoni for? Well, she got pepperonis because they said the 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 areola thing around her nipples is big. Uh-huh. And they given they said it's a pepperoni. So they that's what her emoji is. 
I said, that's what your emoji is? This nigga's crazy. Yeah, crazy as emoji. God, leave me. Mean, but fuck it. We gonna go, we gonna go pepperoni right, here. Is that wrong? Trip, trip. Ariel is being big? No, ain't nothing wrong that's with real. that. Put the chat. Rats or fuck your finger. What's the chat? What's the chat? What's no, not? it's already good. No, you no, no, lost. no. I want to see. You lost. No. Well, can we put the chat up? Can we put the, the poll? Nah. The poll up? The, the, the poll up, please. <laughs> The oh, yeah. Auntie oh. was live on I fucking. Love auntie, man. Auntie no, was sure. like her true one hundred percent self. She need to come do Tuesday with she us. Was, she needs to come do back on Fig as well. Oh, just by herself. Yes, so by her yes. Uh huh. So Tura. let's go, Auntie. Tura. Let's Tura. come through, baby. So Tura. Say, Tura. Tura. Let's go come through, Tura. baby. You didn't think I was gonna make it on Wednesday? What's your name? Everybody in the chat is yeah. yeah. about. He, 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 <laughs> you did great. You say you gonna be here, man. What's up with you? I'm like, man, I'm a beater. I said I'm doing a new thing this year. Yeah. I ain't drinking heavy. I'm drinking champagne and Bel Air, all those shit. You feel mm-hmm. me? Like, I, I feel I've been doing good. Like, mm-hmm. I, even if, if people don't, I feel, nigga, and I showed up and he didn't have to Uber me. Okay. I was there before him talking okay. to Duno Love and that. everybody else. What you and think you about great. that, I was girl? happy to see you there. Oh man, it felt I was good. happy to see you there. It felt good. Yeah. The only thing was missing was my bro AD. So yeah. you got there by yourself? Yeah. With okay. the F U. F U fingers. Oh, that's me. Okay. Okay. Oh, that's yeah. the wobblers going back and back. <laughs> no. Yeah. Right. Wait, wait. Rats, rats. Rats. 55. Wait, wait. Rat 55. Rats. Press it so I can see both of them. I put both of your shit up there. F U fingers and right. Okay, now now now. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see how they both look. Rat 55. We neck and neck. Paul. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. Not a lot of. Yeah, rats. You losing, though. I'm no losing. matter if it's neck and neck. It ain't no, no. Long if I'm in second, that's all that matters. I ain't got no choice but to be in second. No. It ain't no third. Shit. You losing. Hold up, hold up. It's starting to even up. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. He tried to play on me. Look at them numbers now. Yeah, <laughs> they're close. Look at them numbers now, nigga. Put the fuck yous in the chat, nigga. Get Let's 50, get to I'm out of there, are you? Huh? You feel it? Oh, they're going 50 50, you bitches! Ah! <laughs> I love this shit. I love this shit. Wait, hold up. Fuck you. It's 5149, nigga. Yeah. yeah. Oh, no, nah, they doing anything. No, no, nah, don't say that. No, 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 no. No, no, they doing anything. See, do you see how you interact with the people they fuck with? You? <laughs> <laughs> you interacting with them, man. You telling them what's going on. And you tell them what's going on. They run with your narrative. They don't never. <clears throat> you don't never ask them to do nothing. Oh, 54 to 46. Yeah, let's get to that. This is a close ass. Let's call. get to that, this nigga. I'm losing. Yeah, let's get to that, nigga. I'm what losing. y'all talking about? Nigga, talking about Big Smacky, W Smacky. Please give me the W's because yeah, yeah. I am somebody. <laughs> yeah. Give us both W's. Give us all three W's. Nah, nah, nah this we win a competition, bitch. We ain't. Oh, well, I won. Yeah, bitch, it don't matter. If it was a competition, I won. <laughs> you see what it's like? <laughs> all right, y'all, go back to for me to win. Go back. <laughs> <laughs> I love this shit I swear to God Alright switch it up Switch it up Ain't no switching it up Keep that motherfucking score Going high switch, Ooh switch shit up, Terrell got 43 57 yeah. Keep my shit going I wanna get a hundred man Fuck right, him right, nigga stop playing, Let's get to that Alright y'all Stop playing Switch it up Look 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 I know It ain't stop yet Hey hey Come on Keep it going You understand me Switch it up Switch it up <laughs> Sorry, God, I swear to God I hate to see it I love this thing Oh it's a glitch in that shit That shit right, okay. No, it cut off. It cut off. Yeah, it cut I bet off. it did. Yeah, it cut off. It cut off, man. You feel me? Shout out to everybody that's still hanging in there with us. Make sure you like this video here. And I mean, make sure we get 3,000 likes right now. Let's see how many uh, super chats we got going on, man. Yeah, let's get back to that. Yeah, shout out to about, Zion. Oh, oh, you want to start right here? Yeah, shout out to Zion Taylor. He said 499. He said, love y'all to death. I'm out, Cali, because of the mail is here. But I got but I gotta catch up. One of y'all live shows before I leave. For sure, you got to catch up. When are we going to do another live show? Uh, 2024 we'll for sure, right? That's crazy. I, I was reading my About shit. About third quarter. What? Second quarter. I don't even doing another live show. The, uh... Man, I can't wait. Man, we, we tore this shit up. I'm surprised. Man, yeah. we should be booked like we a rapper around for the sure. motherfucking world. We need to already like, be working on that. Uh, February is Heather's birthday. So maybe we can do like a show or something like that for her birthday around that time, maybe for a dollar or something. You know what I'm saying? Maybe I'll book out something. Y'all can come oh. see us live and watch us for a dollar, man. First hundred people in for a buck. 
That's you fun. feel me? And then we, I think we'll probably just do it like a max 120 or something like that. 100, 120. But if it's y'all, y'all the first 50 people, I said the first 100 people. But the first 50 people in for a buck, in for five or something like that, we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. We could do something live like that and y'all can come see us. You've been saying um, you want to do that too. Like a dollar yeah. show. Just yeah. to like support show love. <laughs> yeah, I got that from Brown Bag too. They did a, a on the 800 show, they did a, a dollar a show. A dollar show. Didn't we, That's go? Yeah. didn't we go there? No, no, no. We didn't do that. For the 800 show, we didn't go. Um, but uh, yeah, we're going to do something like that. I just got to pick the cool little venue, get some chairs, get some stuff so y'all can come fuck with us. You know what I mean? Yeah, we got to come to Texas. I think we're going to come to Texas in March, but I don't think Yay. we're going to do a live show. We're going to be out there probably for Pun's birthday. It ain't confirmed yet, though. But we're going to be in Houston Pun's for birthday. Pun's birthday. birthday. When is his when birthday? Pun uh, Pun's birthday is... Uh, I don't know when his exact birthday is, but... Uh, Why are we not going to Texas for Heather's birthday? I mean, oh, Paul, blood. We would have so much enough. fun. We could book, too. I know the yeah, guys yeah. Something, out there that Something book. around, like, the 8th, you know what I'm saying, of March. We can, we can kind of go out there. But uh, he ain't going to do no away. show. He's just going. To party, oh, okay. go to the clubs, go to the strip clubs. I'm trying just to have be broke foot and all. It's real. I'm trying to be there. Go to Houston. That's what I'm yeah, trying yeah. to go. Houston, we're going to come in Houston. We're going to come in March fun. and fuck with us. Maybe we should do an in-store or something so y'all can see us. I think we should all be there. Houston's fine. Um, whoever want to get a flight you from me uh, from Fig Community World, let's go out there for Pun's birthday, man. And then we probably get an in-store in, in or something. Y'all come see us. Come fuck with us. Come hang with us. And you know what I'm saying? Go to the club. Go to the strip club. You know what I mean? Shout out Houston because Houston is one of our uh, biggest supporters. Mm -hmm. We're looking at the analytics right now. But when we do any more shows, Houston is number one on the list. Guaranteed. For we sure. Are, we are coming to Texas, baby. And we finna do it big. I swear to God. When we do Ooh. a show out, when we do a show in Texas, and we gonna do a big, we gonna do an in store in um, Texas too, man. Shout out Sorella, back man, on Fig merch. We sure gonna be out, out there. We gonna do an in store out there too in Texas. So y'all niggas get ready, cause we gonna really come. We gonna keep coming in Houston, Dallas. We gonna do a big. I swear, like. Because y'all really, really support. I know we, we had to knock out uh, San Francisco, New York. We had to knock out the, um, these states. We had to knock out those. So, But we, we coming to the Houstons. We coming to Vegas. We coming to Seattle. We coming to all those that, that support us. You feel me? Like the um, Floridas. You feel me? North Carolinas, the South Carolinas. You know what I mean? Like... We coming out there, but Houston is one of the biggest ones. We coming to Texas. We are coming to Texas. It's real. It's real. When I'm gonna let y'all know that. Oh God, yeah, when I went coming. out there with Big Chief and AD and them, you hear me? What's going crazy? For the Big Chief, uh, oh, no, uh, the premiere when I they opened up, right? Right yeah. out there, and they did a collab with somebody. Do you know that line when we pulled up? They like back on Fig, ah, Fig Munity. Like, bro, they fuck with us out there. They came in the party. They couldn't wait to run up to me because I stayed behind the merch table right there. You feel me? Yeah. I came out, but I'm like, I'm behind the table. Like, I don't know what's going. I'm just cooling. You feel me? They're like, tell Terrell back on Fig. After we love them, move. Like, bro, you out it's, here? Like, it was a movie. It's I swear crazy. God. I it's see in Nashville. I see in San Antonio. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing Phoenix. I'm seeing. Chicago, Arizona, Florida, Michigan, VA. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Even man. Girl, Put y'all city in the chat right now. Put y'all city in the chat. Put y'all city in the chat Mine right now. Let us know. Let's know. Let us know. No, but I went down the street to this North Carolina tenant salon that I've always gone to for the last four or five years. And then this girl, I guess she was a new employee. She was like, Wait, because I told her my name. She's like, wait, Heather Sanders? She's like, I watch Back on Fig. Me and my boyfriend watch Back on Fig. We love it so much. Like, we love y'all so much. Keep doing y'all saying whatever. I came back the next day. She's like, I told my boyfriend that I saw you. He was so jealous that I saw you. He was it. I'm like, that's crazy that y'all don't even know. We go to Texas, anywhere in Texas. Even though I know you from Fort Worth. Shout mm -hmm. out Fort no, Worth. No, anywhere in Texas. No, but I'm just saying. Hey, shout out Fort Worth, Texas, to be exact. Shout out to you. Shout out exactly. Charleston White. Y'all put over. For that you know what I mean, bro, to say, but anywhere in Texas, I promise you, you gonna be bigger than anybody. Hey, your yeah. city fucks with back on big, big immunity. They do. Oh, we go to Texas and you there? Oh, it's gonna be a movie. You gonna bring all the peoples out I can't in wait. the city. You gonna bring them out. 
I your can't moms, wait. everybody, your friends, everybody you went to high school with, middle school with. It's gonna be a movie. It's gonna be a movie. Mm-hmm. Hey, the way they show me love, so I can imagine if we go with you mm-hmm. and we got it's Heather, gonna be a movie. Sandra, they gonna be. Ah, oh, we got the nails, we got the clothes, we doing it, bitch. I swear I to God. I tell all my cousins, they let their friends know. Oh, this my cousin. It's oh, it's a over. movie. It's, hey, we it's gotta over. do Texas. Only man. thing because it's just so family oriented. Right, they stick together. Fair they to support who, whatever you doing. Yes, they make sure you. They come out. They make mm-hmm. sure you know. They they support every business, and I just love it. Yeah. I love that aspect mm-hmm. of it. When niggas is doing something in Texas, they coming out, and especially in Houston. Boy, they treat you like family. They come. Oh, what's going on, cousin? Out, cousin, cousin. Hey, they do all it. that. They doing you like. Uh, what's the movie with uh, Tupac <laughs> and a mail truck? What was that shit called? Tupac and who? And he was on the mail truck with the nigga brushing his hair, man. Oh, what, what movie did we do? What mo- what y'all did, did it. Y'all did, did it for a fucking poetic justice. Poetic justice. Mm. Hey, Tupac went there. Hey, cousin. Hey, yeah. hey cousin. Yeah, hey, they stopped at a barbecue. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, that oh, was yeah, all that's that. all that. that and they really do you like that cousin. Yeah, yeah. cousin, you're going to get some barbecue. They, they don't judge you. you. Yeah. They're, they're going to accept you. For sure. Unless somebody else says otherwise or they have a problem, whatever, they're going to accept you, welcome you with open arms, for give sure. you a plate, give you a drink, give you whatever you need to feel comfortable. That's fair one thing for sure. Yeah, that's like, like her uh, family reunion and all that. It's just too big. How the fuck you supposed to know? Right. I, right. I come in here and get some fish. I want to take one of my... <laughs> you don't know my, who, who I am. Are you? I can let's, stand in line. Right. But that's how I'm supposed to be. One of my 2024, 2024, 25 goals is that me and Terrell are going to plan a Sanders... Uh, Family reunion. Reunion. And I better be there. Fuck all that. Yeah, I, for sure you'll be there. So I'll be at the real place. You better but call me in. Shout out to my cousin Leon Drake. <laughs> <because, laughs> And we gonna be in that motherfucker like this. Yeah, <laughs> my old, but we have a lot of family. It's not no little shit. It's right. a big family. Right. Multiple last names. Right. Shout out to my cousin Leandre because he's been taking on the family union because all of our uncles and aunts are they're getting older now, so they right. don't have time to be planning, planning doing situated, the, figuring it out. Down to the next they're generation. passing it down. Yeah. My cousin Leandre has taken it over for the last two years. Shout so out this to him. year, yeah, shout out to you. So this year, I kind of want to like. Help him, if not take it completely over, right. and really give a good family union. Show them, because a lot of my aunts and uncles, they're n- I don't know how much longer they'll be here. You know, well, back on feet got you. We, we got gotta really show out for them. Yeah, we gotta you know, show it's them. A, it's the taste level as far as how it's supposed to pre- be prepared. Show the, them what they're really worth, because my family is really hey, look, tight. Check like, this out. No, this, you niggas supposed family. to yeah. doing yourself like this. Right. This we're gonna is do what it like you this. deserve. Hey, we're gonna play touch like nothing. this. No, like this. Give it up. Give it up. Slide like this. Yeah. Hey, don't Two touch that. Slide like this. Don't pick up those hands. Don't press. Don't do not Don't touch a barbecue pit. Don't barbecue that. Yeah. I got you. Okay. <laughs> we got it. Like, we'll hire the team to right, cook, right, right, right. clean up, whatever. Like, we'll hire the DJ because all of our family takes a part in DJing, cooking, putting shit on the grill, cleaning up, you know, whatever the case, they all contribute. No contributing. But you know, Enjoy yourself. Yourself. Yeah, yeah, yeah. back on fig got you. We back love you. Back on fig for sure. For sure. Hold on, tell them niggas, sure. you know what I'm saying? All the books that your family wrote. Yeah. Oh, they wrote books? So we have a, a a family cookbook. It's available on Amazon. It is called The Garden of, Garden of Eden. Shout out to my Uncle Bubba who wrote this. Shout out to my Aunt Brenda who got it published. She got it on Amazon. She got it everywhere in all the colleges around the world. And everywhere that there can be a book, she got The Garden of Eden cookbook in there. Right, right. She got the neighborhood established. So they pay the neighborhood to be there, basically. Like, she really has our shit in line, and she really well, makes she, the world well, respect the land that, our family and our name. Well the, land that your, well, the land that your family lives on, it's... Uh, uh, Historic. Yeah, it's historical landmark. Yes. So nobody can never touch it. It's crazy. Nobody can ever touch it. Nobody can ever build on it. We own that. We yeah. own it. We're we never letting it go. That. It go all the way back to the niggas that was stealing shit. What was the niggas? Bonnie name? and Clyde. Bonnie and Clyde. Wait, was, wait. You just want the two the nigga and the bitch that was here. My I family was, they was Bonnie and Clyde. on that. On A-Lane. No, right. my family said Bonnie and Clyde is cool. We won't tell y'all here. We'll hide y'all. Right, get right, under right. here. Get under right, this right, right. Come there. Come here. You got to say that. If hey, the police come, my Uncle Cheney was like, no, nah, they're not here. 
keep it moving. Right. But That's they were dope. there underground. Right, right. That's dope. Shout out we to them. We found gold on our land. We <laughs> we we can fish on our land. We have we have our a land. lake on our land. We Damn. can we can literally survive there without a dime. Shout out we have Tina everything too. we need. We have tell a garden. Them, tell them about the cookbook. We have a cookbook available on Amazon. It's called Garden of Eden. Make sure you check it out. But it's Garden of Eden, and then what's the one that your uncle wrote? Garden of Eden. And then what's the cookbook oh. that your aunt, your aunt Trina wrote? Oh, my Shout aunt Trina. Trina. I don't know if it's available on Amazon, but she made a how to uh, uh, a money tree. Money tree. Oh, she made the money she tree. She made book. them. I think it is available on Amazon. If you search the money tree, search Sanders, it'll come up. Right. She made a money tree. My dad bought it for my kids because he wanted to support his sister, so he bought it from her on Amazon. Sent it to my kids, and it's a book where you're supposed to put like a coin each each week or something yeah, like that. Where you say, yeah, yeah, it's in the little thing. It's you like a, a quarter piggy bank. You put it in there. Yeah, but it's yeah. a book. It's a book. They got all quarters. I know yeah, exactly, exactly. what you're talking about. I know all exactly quarters, what you're talking about. And then once you ended up putting all your quarters at the end, you go check it out, you know, turn it in, whatever you're supposed to, to end up with an amount of money. Yes. She made her own, published her own book. Shout out to my Aunt Trina. Love her so much. I could have so have three books, but I just can't remember. I just know. No, it is. It's one book. It's another one. I could go get it. It's another one. Is From Drew table? Sanders. If you search Drew Sanders on Amazon, it'll pop up. Drew Sanders. What did he write? I don't remember the name of his book, and I feel so wrote. bad because I have it upstairs on my fucking coffee table. No, 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 no matter what, Drew Sanders. <sighs> Shout but no, my family is very talented and, <laughs> and they have a name from where I'm from because my dad was like the there it, it is. was the Garden of Eden. Yeah, the Garden of Eden. And yeah. then what was another one though? But we have the Garden of Eden and we have the Garden of Eden cookbook. Oh, okay, okay. Man, shout slash, out her family. Just write up, books. I mean, don't worry about nothing. Don't worry about anything. You know what I'm saying? Her dad's side of the family don't worry about nothing. You know what I mean? Real legends out here. My mom's side the of game. the family too because they yeah. own all kind of oil. My mom, my mom don't even have to work. She just does. She gets oil checks on the daily. Right, right, like right. Her, her mom hasn't had to work a day in her life because the guy that she married had oil money, and they oil still money. they still get oil checks. That part till this day. So yeah, both of my families are doing great. I'm just here trying to do I look, do I get take on like, my family. If you put some insurance names. on her, you do. <laughs> Keep no, on my sure. family I'm joking, I'm joking. I'm joking. I ain't no way. Get some of that oil money. But we're really from the south, like I get some of that oil money. And long you didn't do the prenup. <laughs> 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 I get some of that oil money. I get some of that oil money. You ain't getting no prenup yet. I do. I do. I get some of that oil money. You get half of that. Yes, that's me. No, but I like know, we yeah, plan yeah. on buying my family's land. Like we plan on purchasing my family's land that they're willing to give us for a really good deal, really good price. Terrell has been talking to them for years. So like that is our next plan. So we can own land in Texas. <laughs> Terrell ain't shit. Terrell really? So, 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 yeah. Hey, so hey, baby. So you know if we get married, you ain't gonna be Hey, hey, hey. We can own that land. So let them <laughs> know that we up next. Hey, cause we got chili like they got. Hey. He's like, how much can Terrell, I pay for that it? That shit just came to me. Hey, hey. So if we could own that in Texas. Yes. Baby, we. <laughs> 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 Hey, 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 they say I ain't the sharpest dresser and the motherfucking knife in the dresser, but I was sharp today. And then, hey, so you know, hey. hey. My, my aunties are like, I would love to give it to Terrell. I would love for Terrell to say, right, right, right. I know you're going to do right by my land. I know you're going to do right by this. Yeah. I know. You know what I mean? He's going to do right. He's hey, going to do right. It's auction 500,000 right now. Hey. Find it right now. Who wants the land? <laughs> right now. <laughs> hey, but y'all stupid as fuck. Our daddy joking. side of the family is all blacks. Big, stupid, dumb black. I'm you know joking, what I mean? Yo, I Indian, be. you know what I'm saying? Native American. You feel me? It was only Native American and her family. You feel me? Sanders family. And, and you feel me? And her family is super intelligent. College graduates. Even her, you know what I'm saying? Her mom's side of the family. But her black side of the family, her dad, all the sisters, you feel me? Like, all chip in, big family oriented, like and that's just you. The the morals and the the values that they abide by, the way they stick together, is something that's just like so genuine. It's Very something genuine. you need to just be in line by. Like it's just crazy. Like and it's a energy when you go in that motherfucking house. You feel me? When you go on that land and when you see these motherfuckers just like sticking together and they cooking together and they is sitting every Sunday and they just making prayers. sure like they yeah it's prayers. They got a church on their land. 
land. It's just yeah, like we have our own it's church. Just like, we got a fucking church on their land. Oh God, mm-hmm. it's just shit you're like supposed to be. Church. It's very special. It's just shit you're supposed That's to be. Dope. Just That's like dope. yeah, and even if they kids that they had don't That's come, dope. they don't give a fuck. It's just all brothers and sisters, and, and they like, make sure they there. Right. Yeah, if you come, you come. Here, you there. Yeah. If you come, you come. If not, this is what we doing. Right. Like the church is not big. It's not popular. It doesn't have a lot of members, but all of our family make sure we show up every Wednesday and Sunday all of our friends whoever we tell it about but it's not like super crazy and it's not about money it's just about a family you know union and it's just like loyalty and family like we stick together it's like we don't have a lot of money I didn't grow up with a lot of money right, right, but right. my family always stuck together my family I know what real family values are like I know you know I appreciate what we do have you know hopefully it turns into money but that's new generations but a lot of to come ain't got that. that's but what I'm saying it's new generations to come your, your, your uncles your aunties your cousins niggas don't show up for you now you, you know what I'm saying yeah. maybe a holiday but that's for five okay. years you know what I'm saying you might get together have y'all been watching my Instagram stories Yes. Yeah, for the yeah. last three. You've been in so in love. No, no. Okay. Yeah, it's fair to say. Shout out to my wife. I have. Yes. But for the last month, I've been at church every... I saw that too. I've been at church every fucking... Mm-hmm. I'm sorry, Lord. Every you week. Have. Every week at church. You hear me? Shout out to my wife because she got me going... I, I've been at church every week. Yeah. Every every week. i seen you. I've been there. You was on, you was on Instagram in there. Yes, yes, yes. I don't like the ugly. <laughs> and I'm not ugly. <laughs> <laughs> So he love me. But no, no. But you know, I've been okay. doing the church thing. I've been doing the praise dancing. Like, nigga, we came number two in the whole world when I was dancing with the church. You feel me? But mm-hmm. I've been doing my church thing. So when I see that shit, I be like, damn, like, I love this shit. You feel me? Yeah. Damn, for you to say that your family so you love the owned, church. Yeah, I do, because I was a praise dancer. So what I, you was doing, what you love about I it love in there? You Remember, church. I did it. I yeah, yeah, yeah. So what the preacher in there telling you? How is he like, he you know like what I'm basically speaking to me when he talk? Also, he, he okay. Oh, so you big sinning. Because he's no, speaking no, directly no, to you. It don't mean that you're sinning. He could be meaning that you're going through what you're going through, so he's talking to you. So yeah. what I identify I'm not with you. when he's talking to so me. So tell me something he I, he said that I identify with you. A young man that was in the streets that was living wild. Okay. He didn't care about <laughs> nothing. Not you, not your son, not your daughter. Mm-hmm. But now, as of today... He believes in stuff. He loves your yeah. son and your daughter. But back then, it was F you, F your son and your daughter. Right. Now, he cares because he got God in his system. You feel me? <laughs> like, for real. You ask me, I'm telling you, you real. You ask me. So I'm like, damn, it was <laughs> that. Back then, it was yeah. trouble this, hoover that, five yeah. one this, five one that, AC2C, that, 12 gang that, 12 gang that. Yeah. Now, I love you as a person. I don't yes. care if you grew up on the east side, the west side, the north side, any side. Yes. I love you as a man and as a woman. Yes. You're not my enemy. Yes. That street shit made you think we was enemy, but no. Mm-hmm. It's bigger than life. It's bigger You're than life. You're not my enemy. Yes. Just because I, you grew up on 51st and I grew up on 41st or grew up on 55th or 57th or 60th or 90th or 111, yes. you're not my enemy. You're yes. really my brother. You're really my cousin. And Amen. I never do this. Amen. I'm not bullshitting. I Amen. never do this. I never do this. Amen. But I done ran across people that's from the other side and that's my cousin. Like, yeah. damn, nigga, I was finna do something to you. Like, you really my family. I swear to God. Church changed me. Shout out my wife. I love you, baby. Hey, hey. Church changed so me. How many you times you went to church? Your wife? How many times you didn't went to church and it changed? <laughs> uh, I, I, really, I've been going to church all my life, but since I met this one young lady, you feel me? Like, like I said, my life ain't for the YouTube or for Instagram. But ever since I met her, I've been going to her church. You feel me? And I've been doing it up because that's what I do. That's in me. I pray every morning when I get up. I pray for me. I pray for you. I pray for Heather. I pray for your kids. I pray for everybody that I know. I even pray for people that I don't know. Yeah. That's what I do. Give me your prayer. Here we go. Father, Lord, thank you for waking me up, looking after me and blessing me, forgiving me for my sins and deaths, forgiving my friends and the people I don't know for their sins and deaths. Father, Lord, please keep your angels upon us and bless us and don't let us follow no badness or no none of that. We're trying to go all right in this, Father, Lord. But if we do go that route, please forgive us Yeah. because we don't mean no harm. Mm-hmm. But at that time, we came in peace, but they broke our peace. Right. So we had to do what we had to do. Mm-hmm. But Father Lord, please look after us and bless us. We love you. And please let us make it to see another day to see our mamas, grandmas, aunties, grandpas, whatever, our friends. Hey, but hey, 
if he wouldn't never bit that apple, we wouldn't be doing bad right now. <laughs> hey, right. Hey, I was just giving it real. But hey, he bit the apple. So if I go ugly it's right true. now, I'm not bullshitting to real. But I'm at the church. If you watch my shit on Sunday, I'm at the church house. You are. I'm not going to put the church I'm at because I don't need nobody coming here on no bullshit. Yeah. Oh, yeah. But I'm there every Sunday and I've been here for the last two or three months. I, love that. I don't know your wife. I don't know what you have going on, but I He's love her. I you love never met her, but you're going to meet her. You're going you, you to meet her. Hey, I would love to she, meet her. Uh, I got, love that for you, though. She got hit off her motorcycle like I did. Yes, wow. I met her in the motorcycle. She got hit off her bike. When I first seen her, she pulled up and bagged up. Bow, bow, bow. I'm like, a female on a Harley Davidson. She parked her shit, threw the kickstand up, boom, yeah. took her helmet off, put it right there on the thing. And it was like love at first sight. Like, I'm looking at oh, her like, I love that. what the fuck? I'm looking at her. She came in there. I'm like, oh, what's that? And she's like, yeah, what's that? And I'm like, Whoa. I love that the, that she has you doing different shit than your daily routine. For sure she Switching do. up your daily For routine. Sure. We're going out to eat. We're going to church. For we sure. might do this. We might do that. You don't ever know. Oh. It's different than what you have going on. I love that for you. We just and had I love that you're going along. Night. Yeah, oh, I saw that. Man. I love that. I, you're a talk, hey, They talking about, oh, that's a man he would. Why he won't show her? Because no, you don't show her. Oh, right. you don't show her. ain't got to show nobody who I'm no. Okay, shout you out church. Love it. Lord Jesus' name, amen. <laughs> I'm gonna bring up another right. topic. I ain't gonna lie to you. I just got a te- I just got a yeah. text from my brother. Who? And I ain't gonna lie. I big deal. My big brother. Oh. And I forgot he used to live on 59th in those apartments upstairs. And he says, "Smack ain't lying, little bro." Ah, let's get I it. used to live on 59th, right off of Fig. Yeah. In those upstairs houses where you could see the top of the liquor store. Right. I remember that. 59th Street liquor store. I came wow. to your house one day. I'm not gonna. Lie. I, I remember that. And he said, "And that nigga Cat used to be over there on the fucking dead end." I'm and this is laughing. my brother talking. Listen, cause. I'm laughing, but that's I'm not in the internet. Listen, he he not, that's yeah. not in the internet. Listen, I'm laughing because it's funny because I really know that what I'm saying is true. Yeah. But you just heard from a dude that's not on Instagram, not on YouTube, not on Twitter, yeah. not in this Instagram, not in this shit world, telling you that I'm telling the truth. Like, tell Cat we was come sit with me, bro. We can have a real conversation, nigga. He know my uncle, rest in peace, nigga. He know my daddy, nigga. So come holler at me. We can talk about this. Right. Like, I got the truth and the details. So he was smoking crack. Man, hey, big crack like this. So he can't say he wasn't smoking crack. Man, he can't deny that. That's you fine. Gotta, you got to man up to I that, mean, nigga. Fine, hey, you just like crack. I man up and said, but I used to get in the ass. Listen, what I used to... <laughs> For real. That's his main thing. Objective was, I have a virgin asshole. That was his main objective. No, I respect him for that. But at the end of the day, don't say you wasn't doing dope. Talking about who could call you out and say you... Like, bro, my uncle... He like, said he wasn't doing dope. Man, the yeah, truth he said is... He, he, said he, said he, he, said he said, whoever had said that I was doing dope. <laughs> whoever said that I was... They was selling me dope. Bitch, I know them people. Like, nigga. Like, yeah. for real, for real, for real. Like, you just heard what your real like, big brother I'm said. I really know these people. Yeah. Like, bro, I can get deep in this, but if you want to talk about it, Cat Williams, hey, we're going to keep How it deep. How old were you? When I heard about this? No, when you were seeing Cat Williams smoking dope. Oh, I probably was like 16, 17. 16, because and I'm 36 I say, now. I would I'm say 36 15, now. 16. Oh, wow. I would say that because somebody in the big, somebody in the, this motherfucker say, oh, Big Deal was doing that. And I'm like, nah, Big Deal was young. And they we was doing, was doing shit. What? They said what? A big deal was over there too, but niggas are just trying to. Uh, no, he was over there with me. Like yeah, that's yeah, why I ran with. Trying to make fan, fun in the chat, but niggas was nah. young. Like like niggas was really in the street. Like bro, I met like, Terrell. We really, I met Terrell through Big Deal. We were really know, Terrell. I didn't know who you was until I met Mad Face. Let's go back. Let's, let's just go, go to Mad Face. Let's go all the way back, bro. <laughs> let's knew, go to Mad Face, nigga. I knew Mad Face, nigga. I love that name. Yeah, yeah like I knew Mad Face. Let's go. Like Mad Face was from uh, HIP Drado. Look, look, I knew Mad Face when Mad Face was from PST. I was from Five First, cuz we was nine years old, like really kids banging the click. Shout out Deuce Rat. I'm talking about Trayvon, Traffic, and Darrell, and them brothers that got a lot of time right now in Washington. I love you. Like, bro, me and your brother go back. So, like, I don't care what they got to say about their narrative. Like, Allen. 
No, we they y'all wasn't. My point is, y'all wasn't doing that because y'all was too young. We weren't doing what? Y'all wasn't smoking the crack. We never smoked crack. So yeah, what y'all wasn't doing that. Y'all just seen it. So we y'all seen it. Was seen shit. We see how we seen a whole lot of niggas that was raw, 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 and then hit the crack pipe. But we never did it. We no, never did that shit. Y'all yeah. was just looking. We y'all just was looking like, high. damn, this was the big homies do. Well, we gonna smoke this stress. We was all stress, nigga. We trying to break down the seeds and throw Collect seeds. It's a five. It's a five. Yeah, five, 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 five hey, two fifty. You got two fifty. You I got two fifty. Yeah, Let's five dollars. Stress back. You got a dollar fifty. You gonna get the bloods. Hey, we like this breaking this like We yeah. never did that. I never did crack in my life. I never did sherm in my life. I mm-hmm. sniffed a little cocaine, you know what I mean, in my life. That was that, though. But no, nah, I never did the old high power cocaine nigga. Like, nah, I we never seen, did that. We seen niggas. That's the whole point, man. We you seen, seen a lot though. of shit on Figueroa, homie. Hey, and normally we seen shit. a whole lot of dope smoking. Oh, normally smoking. burnt out. We seen a whole lot of shirts no, smoking. No, <laughs> they were smoking shirts. I, I, I had to get out of there. <laughs> Hey, this they, like this, me. they got a cigarette that's hey, wet. Like you grew up on Normandy, I can't trust you. No! <laughs> shout out Killer, shout out Mother. Hey, hey, Big hey, Killer was right on the corner. Hey, he was on the corner of the alley. Killer was on the corner of the alley. Watching everything. <laughs> I said, oh, this house is crazy, Killer. I don't know. I love you, Killer Mama. I love you, man. Every time I was over there, I said, oh, shit. I don't know about this motherfucker. Boy, we got to get in the shot. game. We got some more stuff? Yeah, man. We got to get in the game. But shout out my nigga, Killer. Yeah, shout out, man. Kevin. I love you, bro. Yeah. Love you. He got the trenches. Hey, Go get the trenches. Yeah. Why that's my name. Real name. That's my name, Kevin. Mine's is K-A-V-I-N. Why you say his real name? I'm talking to you as a man. Mine's is K-A-V-I-N. His shout out Shadon, too. Shadon, yeah. Yeah. Real, yeah. 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 From Baby Loak. That's shout out homegirl. I know, but you talking about shout out her. Shout I don't out know. Her she was still there. She was there. So shout her up. Shout her up. I love you. <laughs> you got me out right now. <laughs> hey, you finna have her like, yes, the real fuck that bitch ass nigga. We yeah. get to it all the time. Tell her to shut you out here, huh? Big man, look at him. Calm down, You already know I love her to death. Hey, shout, shout out to homegirl up. Shout out Rue. That's his first shout band. Shout out Rue. Oh, we didn't ask all that. No, no, I'm no. just saying, nigga, you want to get messy? Like, we didn't, I shout didn't want to get messy. I just said, shout her out. Shout that's, out. Ke- that's Kevin's sister. She was yeah, there. That's Roddy, baby mama. But it don't matter before no, all of that. Shout out Rue that cut me up. Hey, hey, Rue, I love you, baby. Shout out. Shout out Lil Punch. He, I mean, uh, yeah, Lil Punch. Yeah, shout out uh, Lil Punch. No, Baby Punch. Shout out Baby Punch. You hear me? Why are you fixing no, your flat out? Because that's what uh, Rue got me right. <laughs> <laughs> shout out Baby Punch. You feel me? Shout out everybody. Like, you trying to start some bullshit. Okay, you you out want out to pull up sister, to my house. Huh? Please. Because she was there with us and she was doing She all was. That. She was PSC days, Flirt yes. days, yes. 3P days, yes. uh, MBT days. Yes. She was there uh, Dirty Old Man yes. days. She was there all Hide that. the burner. No, for sure. Going to see what's the deal. Sis, don't let this nigga gas you up. Because she's going to see me and be like, come on. Yeah, look. Jeez. Get down with shit. I'm through with it. Hey, you trying to give me some. Locking with shit. For sure. Yes. So what's the problem? Shut her up. I just did. I love your fucking heart. Shout out to Killer Sister. I love your fucking heart. I swear to God. Hey, Bird. One, two, three. Hey, yo, G, yo, you know what I'm <laughs> Shout out Bird, too. I fuck with my hey, nigga. Shout out, hey, free white boy. Free fucking white boy. Y'all did a toy giveaway <laughs> on Christmas, bro. Mm-hmm. Last year, bro. And they gave my brother 27 years, man. Free white boy, man. We love you, Frank White. You feel me? And... Hey, and the, the set would never be the same without you, dog. Like, you was that nigga, so I want to give you your flowers and let you know, like, you was. You big stupid, yeah. I'm little stupid. That shit hurt. Free white boy, we love you, Mae West. That's his mama. You feel me? We love Loco. That's his uncle. We love Bird. That's his nephew. Like, but we love y'all, bro. Like, free white boy, though. Free, free white nigga, white, white boy. boy. Don't worry about nothing. You know what I mean? And shout out my girl, Leilani. Don't worry about nothing. Sissy didn't want to say nothing. I did um, shout out like Lonnie out. What are you talking about? Like, but, uh, see, yeah, you see, know what I mean? You, you got to start some shit. Yeah, you, you, you did, you did. It's okay. I did. It's okay. You it's okay. shout out like... No, it's like, okay. I fuck with her. That's my nigga. Wow. Don't do that because she going to feel you. She going to go with you no. before she go with yeah, me. I'm going to tell you that now. That's my love. Yeah, all right. Well, hey, Leilani, if you believe what the fuck he's saying, <laughs> then oh motherfucking well for 2024. <laughs> hey, I'm not going to argue with you. I'm all still going to hug you and fuck Roddy and all that. <laughs> 
See? Look, look. He a messy bitch. Hey, Roddy, I love you. All right, man. Nigga, fuck ya. <laughs> They finna replay this like ESPN. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, that's for all girls either. We gotta shout out the homies from the 50s. We gotta do it. Uh, don't worry about nothing. But big shout out to my nigga Lucci, man. Lil Lucci. You know what I mean? Lil Lucci. DeAndre. 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 Lil DeAndre. Lil DeAndre. Lil DeAndre. He's my little DeAndre. Shout out. You know what I mean? I always gotta shout my nigga out to. He was on uh, the other Stone. platform on me too. You know what I'm saying? And, and Stone. Stone. Shout out Stone. Stone, I was like, this nigga is. I, you know what I'm saying? I fuck with this motherfucker. Hey, shout out to Stone for getting out from doing 19 to 20 years, bro, and getting to your family, having kids, having babies, bro. Uh, uh, doing what you uh, love. Listen, listen, doing what you love. And what I mean by doing what you love, then you built a pool in your backyard. You built it cars, trucks, everything. I love you for that. You got off parole in your backyard. You hear me? You and Lucci. Like, bro, I love y'all for that. Y'all never lost, um, uh, like, like, what's the word I can say to her? They never it's lost the love and passion for this for shit. For shit. Like, 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 right now. They went and did 19 years and they came back to the streets like they never left. Basically is what I'm saying. Yeah. They adapted real fast and was mm-hmm. like, hold up, nigga, this was going on? Okay, this is a line? Mm-hmm. Like, shout out to y'all. I just seen Lucci the other night. He came by my house doing 100 on the hall. Bop, bop, bop. I'm like, nigga, what you going fast? He's like, nigga, I lost my phone. It, it fell off my thing. He like, the address say, Whoop de whoop whoop whoop. I ain't gonna say it on here. I'm like, nigga, that's right down there. Like, nigga, hold up. My address is whoop de whoop whoop. That's right down here. And you feel me? Like, like, nah, shout out to them because they came back like they never left. And shout out Big G Scrap because he came back even though he be My flooding like a ever. motherfucker. Even though he come in like this. He be flooding like a motherfucker. I'm like, Cuz really came back. He came back. Nigga, nah, for sure. Hey, Big G Scrap came back. That's my. Crying me. That's the nigga I caught my first juvenile case with. Me, him, and Ricky and Christian. Nigga, like, like, shout out to them because they came back and they back like they never left and they all did 19 years. For real, man. You know, I don't know if you're watching this though, you feel me? But Lil Face, I really. He out! Shout out Lil Face! Hey, he ain't pulled up on me yet. That's my brother. Hey, but. Listen, that's my brother. Hey, Lil Face, nigga. Lil Face, if you looking at this. Boy, you better tap in, nigga. Come to the block, nigga. That's my nigga, dog. Come to. Hey, hey, he over there with Lucci every day, like. Face know what time it is, nigga. No, but they doing their thing. As I want them to. I want want Face to come back. It's a different life. I want Face to come back once he give them back that number. Get him back that whatever number, J, K, A, V, whatever the fuck. Parole. Is. Parole. Get him back that number. Like Big Face did. I mean, like uh, Lucci did. Big like, Lucci. Like, no, like, Lucci. Like, like Lucci did. Like Stone did. And like G-Scrap. He finna get him back his number. Get him back that number. Then come back to the set, nigga. I don't want you to be here when they run your name. Oh, you on parole. We can take you down for... No. Come back when you leave that halfway house, nigga. And you completed your task, nigga. And you off paperwork. Please, because shout out to Lucci Stone and Big G Scrap. Big G Scrap is the last one right now. He finna complete his paperwork. He got his wife coming from San Diego. Shout out to her. I love you. I love you. I love you. But nigga, get off that paperwork face and then come back to the hood. I know what? You. Say what's up? Sick. You can stop by there because if the poet, if crash pull up on us, why you saying what's up? Who they is you? Get a nigga. They can get you and violate you, but right now you're gonna be like, oh yeah, I'm Kevin Deshaun so Hambrick. No, no, I'm Kevin Deshaun Hambrick. Yeah. Oh, you on parole probation? No, no, no. Well, no. Uh, but he's really out there and do it up. And he get do it, it up. Man. Come back when you on parole. I, hey, it's the same. I love the homies, bro. Yeah. Like I know, I do. I want to dead homies. I do, I do, I do, I do, I do. Just do like, fuck with you, do man. like. Man. Do like that nigga Lucci and Stone did, nigga. They stayed away until they got off that mm-hmm. paperwork and gave that number back. Now when y'all bum me up, is there any parolees? No, no, you got you got tattoos on your face. You so, on parole. So I'm not on parole. What do you mean? No, I'm not on parole. Hey. What's your name? Kevin Ambrick. <laughs> they run your name. He ain't on Clean shit. Clean Lewis. Right, bitch. right. Oh, okay, yeah. Shame on you, bitch. Like, leave me alone. That's what we supposed to be doing, you know what I'm saying? Getting it together, you know what I'm saying? Sticking together. Always with our homies, doing it up, you feel me? I, I love it. I love everybody. I got good memories with these with these niggas, man. It's just all good memories, all crazy shit. The bad memories is bad memories because it's just really bad. But the good memories is just like 
You know, I can't, you know, never take that shit away from me because we got skate ring days and party days and all that. Like, <laughs> we, you know what I mean? Like, we, we be in the skate ring. Like, yeah. like I'm up to real. I'm in this to real. Like, they real. like, this nigga's real. real in this motherfucking trip. Can I ask you a question? Yeah. When we came into the shit, when, I, when me and you was talking DM and on the phone, what you tell me? Smack, I got something planned for us. Yeah, I got it. I'm like, all right, I believe you, nigga, but I'm trying to get here. Woo, woo. You like, bro, sit your bitch ass back. I'm like, cuz. Now, look, we're going we gonna to keep it real. This one, it got heated. You had the boy um, Slim on there from 5'7". Yeah. Right? He came and did the podcast. I'm like, Terrell, why ain't on there? You told me in the DM, right? You voiced for me. Bitch, where are you done? Woo! I'm like, what? I had to replay this shit 51, 52 times, right? Is I'm lying? But only nigga that, you never expressed that, but the only I nigga that I did express this in the DM. No, 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 no. And the DM, you never, you always wanted to fuck with me. The only nigga I that ever, uh, the only nigga that ever expressed this to me in my face, nigga, was T2. And he said, group, he's like, Trev, you know how we feel about this shit on the set. Like, I know, I know, I know. He was like, I, I'm going to trust you. I, I fuck with you, but you know. Okay, now, you know Terrell. I mean? but, you don't remember but everybody go, trusts me, though. But I always trust with. you. But listen, Terrell, you don't remember that DM me and you had? When I said, bitch, I've been around the world. And I'm going like, to fuck with you. You like, who is you? Who is you? What you doing? I'm like, is this nigga crazy right I'm now? I'm like, crazy. I'm telling you, what's the deal? Who is you? Nigga, I'm that nigga that been around the world. Oh, fuck what you were. See, that's it's a lot of niggas been around the world. No, it's not. No, it's not. Yes, it is. It's a lot of niggas like been around the world. Like who? Like who? A lot of people. Like who? In general. Like who? But it don't matter. I can't. Who been in Russia? Who been in China? Niggas, who been? Who but been they don't in... clarify. They don't. They don't mean you right for the job. Nigga, that mean I'm nearly that nigga. So talk to me and give my narrative. <laughs> when you was going up, when you was going to Russia, was niggas with you? Was who with me? It was a lot of, it was a whole team. What you mean was with a whole team? You wasn't going by yourself. It was me, Q, Matt Wap, uh, uh, yeah, keep going. Uh, uh, keep mean, going. Uh, 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 keep uh, going. Uh, Kame, keep going. Uh, uh, keep going. And that was it. <laughs> keep going. And that was the whole it. staff. No, 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 the no. Whole staff. We don't say the whole staff. No, no. no. Yeah, oh, yeah, I got to pick the white hey, nigga. It ain't my fault, <laughs> I'm made it. It ain't my fault. I'm made it do past custom, bitch. <laughs> yeah, I ain't did shit. I made it past that. Yeah. It was a lot of people that was when they got to there. They said, "What's your name?" Boom, they ran the name. They went like this, uh, 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 and they had to go this way. I fell asleep like this. <laughs> Somebody said them. Heather Boy. That's, hey, that's okay. Hey, hey, I fell asleep like this. I said, "Please," because we was in there like eight hours. I said, "Please don't let them wake me up." Talk about this. They woke me up like, "Hey, you good?" Like, Go here, I said, oh, bitch, I'm <laughs> Yeah, we go, you know what I'm saying? We ain't gonna hear Heather Bohr one time, you know what I'm saying? We still got 6,000 6, okay. people in here. Make sure y'all like this video. You right feel me? We got the topic. She finna like bring up. up. She finna bring up right now. Don't worry about nothing, you know what I'm saying? Damn, we gonna go, go, go switch it up into another thing. You got a piss? Go ahead, go ahead, go B real quick. I don't want to know, because I don't want to know. Go ahead, go ahead. We're going to bring it up. We can, we can, uh, I don't want to miss nothing. Go ahead, we ain't going to miss nothing. We ain't going to miss nothing. You feel me? We're going to make sure we, we got it going. You feel me? Before we bring these topics up. But shout out uh, Imperial again. Make sure y'all tap into them. You feel me? Make sure y'all use our QR code right now. Make sure you use our code FIGG. Make sure you go to imperialinstractions.com and mm -hmm. use that. You feel me? And any purchase, you will get a, a free pre roll. You feel me? And they deliver everywhere. All 50 states, you know what I'm saying? Right to your door. They ain't got to worry about nothing because some people ain't legalized. Y'all ain't, y'all, y'all know y'all not legalized. So don't even, don't even worry about it. But this shit coming right to your door. Right. You ain't got to sneak. You ain't got to do nothing. Don't drive with nothing. Don't do none of that shit. Don't get pulled over with nothing. I got That's you. That's legal. You know what I mean? I definitely got you. It's going to be the same way. Don't worry about nothing. Don't, don't listen to nobody. This shit is crazy because we got it all in our room. You feel me? We give it up and give it away. So all 20 of you people that I said I was going to give something away, Six is definitely uh, making sure he gets y'all address, y'all name, and yeah. everything because we definitely going to ship this shit ourselves. We're not going to wait on nobody to ship it to you. 
Um, we gonna ship it ourselves because we don't want no delays. Because I promised a lot of people that I was gonna give them some stuff beforehand. I took their name and address, and it still ain't happened. But that's okay because I still got y'all shit locked and loaded. I never forget. I don't never forget nothing. It was a young lady too that said her dad love um back on Fig. Um, she gave the wrong address. She she got a hat. And it didn't come. I know she, you know what I'm saying? They got shit back or whatever the case may be. She wanted a refund. When I said, nah, we ain't no, gonna give you no refund. We're gonna give you a hat. We're gonna give you something extra with it. We're gonna give it to your dad. And mm. shout out to you, man. I hope you got mm -hmm. your, your package, your t-shirt, your hat, man. If you're watching right now, shout out to your daughter, man. Because she number one, man, for making sure you you um, you um getting what you're getting. And I'm like, damn, niggas' daughters watching this shit. I said, it's Young niggas watching this shit or old niggas watching this shit? Y'all had me confused. Bro. So is it both? We got young and old niggas. If we got young and old niggas watching it's this both. shit, it's definitely lit. You feel Bro, me? It's lit. definitely lit. young and old niggas. Shout yeah, it's definitely lit. You feel me? We gonna get into some topics right now and we gonna see what it do. You gotta use the bathroom too? Mm -hmm. Okay, Heather finna go, you know what I'm saying? Use yeah, the bathroom yeah. right now. We'll get into yeah. some topics when she get back. Uh, Kyla Davis, he said, shout out back on Fake Family. But run me those munchy bars. <laughs> we gonna run those munchy bars. Don't worry about nothing. Uh, Perk Brady said, Heather Yam Cam. She ain't even no Yam Cam in them stiff ass jeans. <laughs> uh, the Round Table Podcast, man. Shout out y'all. Make a Halloween T-Rail and Heather get some mushies. Yeah, you know what I mean? My girl wanted to take a pic with Heather, but she wasn't at the meet and greet in NY. Love y'all, BOF for life. She wasn't at the meet and greet in NY. But y'all would have did it if she would have pulled up. I, I, yeah, I'm going to tell you, yeah, I'm going to keep it real. Up, if y'all would have pulled up, like, like, a lot of shit goes on. Like, I didn't been to parties where I, was, I wasn't invited and I paid to get in. But I know if I would have met that person or that female, they would have gave me a pick. And y'all one of those types, you real for sure. Y'all yeah. would have did that just out the kindness of your heart, for sure. Uh, Mo, man, hey, uh, Boo2047 from Houston wants to send our uh, ski mask merch before the drop. 2224. Hey, man, DM me so I can give you my um address for the send that so we can see what that shit do. TK, man, shout out Smack for trying to rap along. With uh, with the old boy, I I don't know if he was uh. Which one? Where we at? Where we at? The Shout Arabian, out Smack for Arabian trying nigga. to rap you know along I mean? with the Shabu nigga. With, yeah, yeah, he's my hey, 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 he's a hey, hey, and shout out to him. I don't he's know a, the nigga he's name. A, he's a famous YouTuber out there in uh. Oh, uh, well, how can I say? How can I? I'm not Saudi Arabia. Saudi Arabia. Yes, yes. He came to the fifties and he wanted some uh Southsiders and some uh Federals. You feel me to be in this video? So my boy that was a South Sider hit me, nigga, me, T2. He hit me, uh, T2, and your brother, Big Deal, and uh, uh, Hoover Tune. Uh, I don't know if he baby Hoover Tune. I, I don't want to make, I don't want, I don't like saying it because I want to fuck with my No, 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 fuck with his name up. You talking about the big nigga? Tune. That was bodyguarding with Nate and. Oh, okay, okay. You know okay. what I'm saying? I don't want to fuck nobody name. We know like, you. Yes, yes. Like, like he Yo, just, big ass. Yes, he just. But we can't say it on stream right, right. because your he name just is invited everybody. He, yeah, he just, he just invited me to a fucking New Year's thing, and I was with your brother right when he was at my club. But like, yeah. like, he know where I am. Shout out. Capital H is capital T's. He know what time it is, but you feel me? I was with him, and he got. Like, you feel me? But nah, shout out to that though, for sure. Man, shout out to the homie, man. Shout out to Yaz. I see you still in the uh the chat, you know what I'm saying? Love you, yes. <laughs> Use the code, man, you know what I mean? But yeah, um Period on Stractions, make sure y'all hit that QR code, man. Use our code F I G G one time. That part. Uh yeah, that part, man. I think this is the Where we at? Where we at? A John L. Cash 15, man. Hey T Rail and Smack Water. Why was Pun wearing traffic jeans? Okay, we already said oh, yeah, that. He wasn't wearing like oh, yeah, we, we already said that. I ain't yeah, gonna do yeah, that. I ain't gonna yeah, let yeah. you try to ha ha. You trying to get me? Ha <laughs> ha. Uh, okay. we we gonna ask Heather that when she get back. It said Heather, we need to know how you lost that weight, man. What's the tea? Oh uh, yeah, she gonna get you know know date like ESPN. Uh, uh -huh. we have uh, we have a bike downstairs. We have a treadmill downstairs, and we also got a, a weights sauna. downstairs. We got a sauna downstairs. We got weights downstairs. You can get it popping, nigga, in the garage if you need to. No, you know for sure, saying? for sure, for sure. You can hop up, you know what I'm saying, and hop in a sauna, get on a bike a little bit. 
15 minutes, 20 minutes, hop in that sauna and see what that shit do. But it's right there downstairs, man. I ain't gonna lie to you. For sure, I'm gonna get on that bike once they get the pins on my foot. I'm gonna be on that motherfucker like this. Like, no, for sure. Are you gonna start working out? For sure I am. I I ain't got no choice, for real. If I wanna stay like this and be crippled and disabled, being a punk ass bitch, okay, I'm gonna stay like this. But if I wanna work out and and nigga, I'm finna handle my candle. Uh, Bruce Concrete Cody, uh, he said, appreciate y'all, appreciate y'all staying authentic. FMW overall. That yes, part, thing, that part. Really were, oh, you yeah. fucking cock, bitch. Uh, hey, you see, I was there for the first day, right? Every day, you every nigga trying to count me out, but I was there, though. Yeah, he I was, was there. there. He was there. He was there. Like, I was there. My nigga AD was sick, but that's all good. Man, What's I can't think wait about? to do it on... This Wednesday when he there because he yeah, wasn't when he there. there. Yeah, you, you sitting in the middle. Shout out Punk. And you sitting in the middle. I don't care where I sit. You sit in the middle. Oh, hey, you can sit me in the middle on the outside on this outside in the middle. And I'm still gonna be that nigga. You know, yeah, Shout nigga. out to the whole fig community. I'm gonna be that nigga. I'm gonna yeah. shine just like we all gonna shine. I'm gonna shine. Put That's me right. anywhere. That's right. Put me on the outside of you. Pause. Put me on the outside of him. Pause. Whatever. I'm Whatever. gonna shine. Uh, Bone Slave said, "What y'all think about Pope walking out on the on out on homie? We already discussed that, that, but yeah, he did what he out. supposed to do. We did what he supposed to do. He did what he supposed to do because mm. if he'd have let that shit linger and keep fucking with him, he would have grooved the nigga. Mm-hmm. And then if you'd have grooved the nigga, you already know what's going on. What's uh. coming after that? They gonna call the police. They gonna show cameras <laughs> and footage and all the whole little shit. He gonna go to jail because he's his hoes. Hello, but he for sure would have grooved the nigga for sure, even in there playing around and doing all that shit. But I, 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 I DM the nigga right after that. I'm like niggas is hoes. You feel me? And y'all niggas see why. Now niggas see why you feel me? Right. Niggas is probably a a bigger interviewer than me. Maybe got some more subscribers than me. It is a bigger pla. It's a bigger platform. Whether you think uh, whether you said or not, you feel me? Because you know niggas is doing more shit on the no, daily. No, it's real. But you know I found out. I found out. It don't matter if we like like okay. Look, let me just say this as an example. I'm gonna say this on some real shit. Like I ain't this nobody. Nothing. Like right now. Say if you wasn't my partner, right? I'm gonna use you as an example so it won't be no bullshit. Say you, I didn't know you from a can of paint on the wall, right? Mm-hmm. And I start a podcast. You got a podcast, right? Mm-hmm. But you speaking on me and I left your podcast that I was working for, right? Mm-hmm. And then when you speak on me, I go viral because I tell you the real, like, nigga, I'm gonna fuck about what dude gotta say. You try to disrespect my set, nigga, and the homies check you in a polite way because they know if anything else from there happens you're going to jail yeah so i respect poke and i respect that i ain't gonna put the other homie out because he had a beanie on that you know I mean? and we not like the other side and we not we're but, not gonna sit there and dish you dish your set but but this real, real, but this real. All he that. know what he's he doing though. Do he know what he's doing though. He know he got the other side. What is, I'm gonna say the other side. But he don't know. He do. He don't know, know he got the other side. He know he know he got the other side, but he don't know the other. He don't know us. He don't know that we're not gonna say what they're saying. See, they're they're dissing the set. We know that. No, 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 but, but not he know that. they just to say at the end of the day. So he's trying to play with us. Like, like. Yeah, he's trying to play with us, but we're sharper than that. We're smarter than that. And we're not going to do that because we don't do that. We don't do that. We, we don't, don't. We don't do that. We, we don't. But at the end of the day, if you do that, be ready. Man, I'm gonna no, shut up. I'm gonna Yeah, you can't. Yeah, yeah, but if we do, oh, we dog. already. But we don't do that. Cause we don't, and out of respect, because we got family that's the neighborhood for forty six oh five seven five five. Like nigga, and I know them niggas. Dude. That's respectful, and I'm glad that Poke showed he sh- oh, utmost yeah, respect. Yeah, 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 for sure, for but sure. But it's still fuck it. it. It is that I wish Poke would just like. <laughs> We out here. Cool. Hey, hey, and if you all right. <laughs> hey, if you the just, hey, hey, look, look, if you the just, yeah, so you know what the ass in the. Hey. 
<laughs> hey, I know, <laughs> but we are faded. I ain't even gonna lie to you. You know what I'm saying? But we gonna let Heather get into. This. Can you get into it? Mm-hmm. We got a couple no, topics see, we gonna I, get into. You know what I'm saying? Before we go crazy, before we we get up out of here, man. We almost been in here for three Sorry. hours. Make sure oh. y'all tune in. If you ain't like the video already, make sure you like the video. You know what I'm saying? If you ain't subscribed to the channel, make sure you subscribe. Subscribe to the channel, man. What you got to ask? Like, subscribe, all right. and all that. Let's get into some of Heather's topics. So the question is, how much does physical attraction matter to you in a relationship? How much physical attraction? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Can you break it down in content? When you say how much do physical retraction mean? Attraction. Okay, what do I mean? Break it down so I can understand it. Is it important for your significant other to be good to look at? Good to look at, want to look at, or is it about her personality, about her, you know, insides, all this right, stuff. Right, right. Physical attraction doesn't matter. Okay, okay. Like, me with me. Like I just told you, I'm going to be married in a motherfucking year or two. Like, you are? So you're actually getting married. You're going to get married before shout me and Shout out to my wife. I'm shout out to her hey, for real. Shout out hey, to Terrell. Didn't we just add we real, was on Wednesday time, right? You're going to marry her listen, and me and Terrell ain't even married. I like, that God, shit listen, is crazy. Shout out to her because when I'm down, I'm sad, I'm out, and I get mad, she be with me everywhere at the motorcycle club. Mm-hmm. Like, we'll meet up there. Like, I get mad because I ain't on my feet, be able to do what I could do. Yeah. Shout out to that because I love her. She she make me feel like nigga it don't matter. It don't matter. Yeah. Fuck your foot, nigga. I, it's real. <laughs> she makes you feel like yeah, that's for real, bitch. Hey, I'm telling you some real shit. Hey, I'm bringing you in my room now. Like no, so she fucking you because you down because you can't no, really no, fuck no, around no. with no she, other bitches. No, no, your no, foot no. fucked up. No, no, no. That that's a oh, lie. So she taking advantage you, you, of you. No, no, you lying to me. You lying to me. She's taking advantage of you because you're not a hundred percent. You up. You can't. You, you up, but you're not up. You can't really fuck with no hoes, so she fucking with you. She know her nigga gonna come back home, and she gonna, he gonna get this home cooked meal. You know what I'm saying? She probably gonna give you some head. You gonna lay down, and hey, you good, bitch. I'm gonna let you talk. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm gonna let you get your dare. You through? Okay. You're wrong. Okay. She love me for me, who I am, the character that I am, and the man that I am, and what I bring to the table. I'm me. What do you bring I, to the table? Let me ask that. What do I bring to the table as far as what, Terrell? You me tell me. me. Nigga, I bring a lot to the table. My energy, my love. <laughs> I come in peace, but my peace could be broken, nigga. I bring a lot to the table, nigga. When like, you went out to dinner the other night, y'all posted on Instagram, <laughs> who paid for that meal? She calling me. Hold up. Let's get to that. Oh, hey, let's hey, see. Hey, Terrell. Okay. Whoa! Yeah, like, like, don't okay. play. Don't okay. play. Oh, hold up, look. Oh, no, no, no. Don't play with me. What is he no. talking about? We finna find out. Don't, don't play with me, though. Hold oh, on, let's like, see. I gotta like, put my what headphones. What you was saying, Heather? What you was saying, Heather? I'm saying, I gotta who put my paid for that meal? Oh, let's I see. I paid for a lot of meals. But, oh my God! Let's get them headphones on, man. Like, What's like, going on? Like, like, don't, don't, do, me. don't do me. Don't do me. W's in the chat for the wife. Yeah, don't. W's in the chat for the wife. Y'all wanna play with me now? <laughs> Call her Baby, back. what's that? Baby, chat. talk your shit. Hey, okay. Hey, Huh? Y'all doing too much. Man, man, talk your shit, though. Hey, no, 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 no. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. Let the record reflect. Like, niggas want to play. Like, we going to keep it clean across this table. Up, it, boy, no. Then why you call me if you ain't going to let the record reflect? So, she, so she taking advantage. <laughs> no, no, no. We going to find out. We going to find out. You got my my wife mad now. She done called in. Why you mad? Not my wife. Why you mad? Oh wife? my god! Hold on. Why call is mad? Because y'all playing with a real. We not way. playing with a no, real no, no, way. No, you so really she mad because I'm playing with you. Man, oh, I don't know. know. We gonna let her explain. I don't oh, we know. just we just ask her questions. Oh, I love her for that. Hey, she just called in on me. She's doing way too much. Hey, hey. hey. Uh, okay. hello. Come on, wife. Wait, wait, what'd you say, baby? I said Terrell got me fucked up. All right, then okay, let the record explain reflect. Explain yourself. Explain yourself. Let the record reflect. Let the record reflect. How you feel about Smack and what you're doing? Give me the fucking phone. All right. Oh, she hung up. Wait. 
Hey, you Terrell better got fucking, you you better fucking answer that phone and See, tell him the why, record. This is why niggas don't introduce me to their girlfriends. Okay, this is okay. This is Terrell. Okay, look, check this out. Let the rec. Okay, let the record reflect. What? Okay. Hold on. Let the record reflect on why you love Smack. I love Smack. Why I love Smack? Yeah, why you love him? You know what I'm saying? Why you love him? You know what I'm saying? And what about him that you really love that really sticks out? He is a people person. He lights up the room when he come in. Anybody room, anybody, anything. Like, come on. He, he's the shit. I love him for him. His personality is bomb. He know how to be cool. It's that drinking though. Like I just text, bro. You don't need nothing else to drink. Don't give him nothing else to drink, Heather. No more shots. None Same. of that. You know, gotcha. that's over with. Also, you checking him? You checking him on that? You making sure he's doing the right thing? You know what I mean? I love that. I love. I love that you. You know what I'm saying? You putting him in his place. Yes, sir. Yeah, you know what I mean. But uh, uh, as far as that, what do you? You know what I'm saying? The aspects. You know what I'm saying? That stick out to you that you really love about this young man that's keeping you that that's keeping you there. Yeah. That he ain't giving up on himself right now. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah. And he, he down. And he, he ain't giving up. And he down for you. Yes, sir. And he down for you, and he stick with you, and he going out with you. Fair to say. Fair to say. <laughs> fair to say. <laughs> fair to say. <laughs> Oh yeah. my God! Y'all yes. gotta be hot right and, there, okay? And he, and he paying for them dinners. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes. Oh, he's he thirsty. Okay, <laughs> I love you to death. We gonna get up out of here. That's all we needed to know. <laughs> yes, sir. All right. I give up for you, bitch. Okay, nigga, she nigga, shut up, my wife, nigga. Yeah, I love her for that. Hey, she kept it gay since my owl. She kept it real. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> I love you, baby. <laughs> oh my god! Oh, Kiwi. <laughs> oh shit! Oh shit! We love that. You see that? You and me back on thing. You never gonna get nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? Shout out, uh, Smack. Shout out his wife. That nigga put his glasses on because he was scared as a bitch. <laughs> he was so scared. He was scared. I was nervous. I was yeah. shaking like a mini bike, like a Harley Davidson. Eh? <laughs> I'm like, please, baby, please talk to me. We gonna be scared. You see, we when we get up out of here, we gonna say we gonna go, we gonna cover a couple more, and then we gonna go over a couple of super chats before we get up out of here. <laughs> but, you know what I'm saying. Thank you for tuning in with us. You feel me? Make sure y'all like the video. You feel me? We right almost now. still got about six thousand people uh, sitting here with us, man. Make sure y'all give us three thousand likes. We got about twenty six hundred, man. We only need about uh, four hundred, four hundred um, more likes. So make sure y'all get three hundred. Make sure y'all like it. Nothing. Like that shit. That ain't man. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 no. And Charles and White yeah, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, yeah, no, 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 Man, let's see. Uh, we going platinum, no, no, baby. No, no, no. Yeah, we going platinum, baby. Make sure we get 400 more likes, man. If y'all ain't like this video, make sure you like it right at now. now. Oh, what else we got, Heather? Mm. You hearing I me? Mean? What if right here, girl? Oh. What are you talking about? <laughs> Sorry. Okay, so if you... I can't fucking see it. If you could get one more album from a rapper who is no longer alive... Who would it be? Tupac. Of course. <laughs> if you could get one more album from a rapper who is no longer alive, who would it be? Who would it be? In your category. Not ours. I'm going to say Nipsey Hussle because that was the one that really <clears throat> affected me that passed <clears throat> away, like that I knew about, that I was a fan about, that I was a fan of. I would say Nipsey Hussle. Big flags in the chat, man. Big flags. Marathon flags. Marathon continues. Of course, it's going to be Pac for us. We come from a uh, different generation. But, uh, yeah, man. Nipsey, too. I fuck with that, man. Because I just love Surreal. how Nipsey flags makes you want to go get it. Chat. Now, listen. Flags this in the is chat. a true story. Trill. Yeah. Trill, look at me, dog. On 12 Gang. This is a true story. When that happened, I was on 51st at my mama house. I came outside, got in my car. And I was talking to the homies. I forgot who was in the car with me. I'm like, I'm finna go live. 
This the first time that I hit 2,000 to 3,000 views on Instagram. They like, Brr. hey, I'm falling. I'm like, traffic, little traffic. What's the fuck going on? I'm like, bro, I got 1,000, 2,000. They like, RIP Nipsey S. I'm like, what the fuck going on? They're like, what you think about if I'm lying? That's on Cassandra Renee Hambrick heartbeat. I'm like, bro, what the fuck? So I ended it. Boom. I'm like, somebody must have hacked my so shit. So you scared? I was, if I'm, that's on my mama, that's on my uncle, Donye, H-I-P. I was scared. I'm like, is this fake? So I ended it. Boop. I'm like, bro, let me go back live and see. When I went back live and went to 15, 16, 17, they like, rest in peace, Nipsey Hussle. And that's when I exit out and I went to a million hits. Because that was popping back then when that happened. A million hits showed that, yeah, Nipsey Hussle got shot at his shop. I'm like, what the fuck? They wanted to hear my, that's when I knew, like, you a nigga, like somebody, they want to hear what you got to say. Hey, you hear what I'm saying? Like, I'm like, what? I'm like, Don Trail, Darrell, look. I said, I, I exit out at least two or three times. Like, look, let me exit out because I don't want y'all to think I'm bullshit. And then bullshit. once you figured it out. I'm like, wow. And once you figured it out, you knew the news. Did you go back live? I went back live and like, But what man, did you say about it? Rest in peace, Nifty Hustle. I met him with Terrell Meach, nigga. Terrell Meach took me to the motherfucking all-star basketball game. I swear, this is public wreck. where well, they can look this up. I'm like, bro, I met him. He told Terrell, hey, congratulations on your baby. She was pregnant at the time. Is I'm lying? Mm -hmm. that? We was at Monster Dressing Room, right? He said, congratulations, man. I ain't on the baby. Ooh. Then he looked at me like, oh, you funny, I fuck with you. He like, hey, I'll follow school. You remember that shit? Yep. I'm like this, I'm scratching my head like, this nigga Nipsey just told me you fuck with me. You from the neighborhood 60 Crip. Like, he just told mm -hmm. me, hey, you the funny nigga that be with Q. Cause I was, you feel, is I'm lying, Terrell? No, you're lying. He like, Terrell, shout out to you. Congratulations on you and Heather on your baby. Was it Zoe? Who was it? Was it had Zary. to be Zary or Zane. Who was it? Who was it born that time when me and you went to meet up with Mustard? Zane. It was Zane. Zane. Wow. I swear to God, nigga. Cowboy was there with his cowboy hat on, playing basketball. Like, funny. Hey, <laughs> you know, we was in the dressing room with Mustard, and they came, walked in, and I looked at Terrell, because I'm still on that wow shit. So I looked at Terrell like, 50s, like, what's happening? We seen, the uh, shout out his, um, his fucking bodyguard. What's his name? Uh... He a blood too. Why nah, he from Gray Street, nigga? J no, 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 no. We ain't talking about the nigga from Gray Street. I'm talking about YG bodyguard. Where he from? He from Bloods. Okay, the the one we call what's the name though? Um, Gloves. Yeah, Gloves. Shout out Gloves, cause Gloves was in there. Then YG came. He came with my boy. That's from Gray Street Watts. You hear me? That still bodyguards his wife to this day. Mm -hmm. He came with him, and when we was at the door, I'm like this. It just me and Terrell. We, we did that. The security guards and that. So I'm lying, Terrell. We was in a Rolls Royce, right, in a, 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 your red car. We pulled up. They like, oh, he like, oh, what's up, Terrell? He was walking in. He had his jersey on. Cowboy had that jersey on. We was right there at the exit. He walked in like, what's up, Terrell? If I'm lying, stop me when I'm lying, Terrell. Terrell like, oh, what's up? He like, congrats on your baby. Congrats on your baby mama. You finna have a new baby. Terrell like, oh yeah, for sure. Woo! -hoo. Didn't look at me. Was like, oh, this nigga crazy. You like right? that, huh? Huh? You didn't tell that story ten times. I bitch. don't. Can I tell it uh, 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 eleven times? Can no, I tell it? No, 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 Phil. No. Can I tell it eleven times? Can I tell it eleven times? This should be your last. Number okay. Oh time well. Can it be my last time? So what? But nigga, I got the medium. Man. I'm, I'm, I'm glad for that. Like, like, don't, don't he judge gave me. You, yeah. He gave you some. He gave you some little uh, recognition, and you happy. <laughs> okay, right. Hey, I'm gonna take you to the grave. I'm gonna take you to the grave. I'm gonna take that to the grave with me, though. Don't take a lot of people. I fuck with him. Like, he really that nigga in these. He recognize you when we fuck with him. That's all I'm saying. That's all I'm saying. My nigga want the recognition. We got it. My nigga want the recognition. We got it. got it. We got it. We got it. You know what I'm saying? Next is, what's the hardest decision you ever had to make in a relationship? Hmm, I can't talk about that. That's your question, Terrell. <laughs> well, bitch, what's the way? That was the way you had it right there. What's no, what? The hardest? You just got in a relationship. What? You just got in a okay, relationship. Okay, so it don't count to me. Why? Just so got what's your hardest decision? Because you just made it your wife. That wasn't your hardest decision? 
No, it wasn't. So we talking. Oh, about so you just breaking? You just making niggas your wife? Nah, 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 nah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, 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 yeah, nah, yeah, nah, yeah, nah, 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 nah. But we no. talking about you and Heather right now. What <laughs> we talking about me and Heather? No, 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 no. Get alone. Yeah, that part. So we I don't have no hard decisions. All right, then act like it, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I hate this hey, nigga. Not had to do with <laughs> I hate this nigga, y'all. The fuck? He ain't shit. Then why you ain't marrying him yet, nigga? <laughs> well, that ain't not hard. That's that not hard. That ain't hard to you. That's you, not you. a hard decision. All right, you've been together over a year. Why so? niggas keep asking that? Like, oh, we just got to hurry. Hey, do it. Hey, then, hey. Once we do it, then what niggas going to do, say? Hey, okay, congratulations. Hey. We love you for that. All right, then what? We love you. It ain't going to do nothing. It is. Fuck out of here. That's what you are for. It's going to have you up for it. Man, it's gonna shit, add her up more. Hey, look, man, that shit is uh, that shit is phony, man. You got so you're pay, not getting married to Heather. Yeah, yeah, you got to pay wait, wait, for a so relationship you're not getting Heather married and to break Heather. up for a relationship. Man, no, that, that shit ain't is, true. That ain't true. Don't worry about nothing. That ain't true. Hey, that shit is that shit I'm, is. I'm gonna prove y'all wrong. When I marry my wife, I'm gonna prove y'all wrong. You have to pay. How the fuck is Smack gonna get married? Hold on, hold on, hold on, man. You have to pay to pay for what? What I'm paying for work. Okay, I will. And then you gotta pay to break it up. You no, no, no. If you break up, you gotta pay. You gotta prove it, bitch. Nah, you ain't gotta gotta prove it. Yes, you do. Once he filed for divorce, you have to pay. Okay, but if I file for divorce first, bitch, you you gotta gotta pay. pay. No, she gotta pay. You still gotta pay. No, I'm gonna pay, but I'm gonna get it out the end of that bitch. I'm gonna get off the back end, bitch. Cause I'm gonna sue her for anything. I'm gonna get everything. That's so dumb. Wait, so 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 that shit is a scam. No, no, fuck that. You and Heather. Said Heather, you told Heather, Heather, would you marry me? Yes. And she said, I do. Yes. You gave her the promise ring. Yes. You got your ring. Yes. But now it's time for y'all to set y'all vows and down. It, it'll happen when it happens, but it's no rush. What's the rush? What's your rush is, bitch? You want a party? No. Oh, my God. The rush is, you might be dead tomorrow. She might be dead tomorrow. What they got to do with anything? Wow. So. What's hey, what, what hey, that got to do with it? You, you hear what he said? Hey, come here. Let me get over here, sis. Hey, <laughs> hey, do that cool. Hey, hey, you Don't hear make me? me call your girl because I got her number. Get her number, call her. Yeah. I swear to God, you call my wife. Glasses. Hey, I'm, I, I'm glasses ready to put on. my vows in a day or tomorrow, nigga, right now, and I'll plead to it. Because she's going to pay, huh? I'll pay for all that, nigga. And then you're going to pay to break up. We not gonna break so, up. Okay, we not. I don't okay. believe hold on, in that. Hold on, hold on. I don't so believe you, it. So when you break up, you gonna have to pay her spousal support every He's month. Shy. No more. Oh, so when good. you break up with her, you gonna have to pay her spousal support. Every no, month. that's whoever wins that court. I, so if she's your gonna win. If your it's her narrative against my narrative, and then she's she gonna can, win. She's in California. She's not, because I'm going to have the best good. lawyers, bitch. I'm back on fish. I'm going to have the best lawyers. I'm going to have five or six lawyers in that motherfucker. Like, you looking at her one lawyer like, oh, so you think you you going to win, you stupid? <laughs> oh I got my five God. of them. Four minutes, you, you really drunk? Yeah. This nigga really stupid drunk back here. We finna get up out of here. She looking crazy. Wait, That's we were talking on this shit. Terrell was talking. Because I'm serious. This is leaning. But we was having a good conversation right now. We were yeah, talking on this shit. But I just happened to look at the camera and she leaning like. But no, Terrell, Terrell, Terrell. So, so, Terrell. So, she don't Terrell, taste shit. Terrell. She just be doing okay, shit. Okay, Terrell. So, if I got five good lawyers on back on feed that love me, you know what I mean? Okay. You feel me? Against her one lawyer. Who gonna win? The laws in California, you're gonna lose. Oh, I'm gonna lose. Cause all I got five of them against your one. So I'm gonna lose. Who? It's the laws in California. They Still, always okay, side well, with I the women. I get ten of them. That means California. That mean I got five of them, and you gonna bring five of your lawyers in, and they gonna come together, and we can't. It's just like a custody battle. If you go with, if you go into a custody battle in California, in Los Angeles, California, and you going for your kids, you're losing. That's not true. You're lying, right? That's not true, Terrell. That's not true. That's not 99.9% true. 99.9% of the time, you're going to lose your kids. Because you're a low you're budget gonna, with no money, you ain't got the right lawyer. It don't like, matter. Man, they Terrell. They side with women. No, they And then they go get them lying. child support. You're lying. Nah, 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 nah. You lying to me, young man. I'm no. Charleston White right now. Who got their kids? Nigga, my boy Ryan... Ryan Kane, a.k.a. T.L. She a crackhead, that's why. It ain't and no she female. probably didn't show up to work. Listen, she probably didn't show up to court. That's not a female, that's Hoover Love. Hoover Love, nigga, tiny Hoover Love, nigga. Stay and his baby mama didn't show up to court. It don't matter. He been having them kids since they was born, nigga. And his, and his baby mama didn't it show up to court. It don't matter. If she showed up to court, she, had she did kid. show up to court and she showed up loaded in a motherfucker because oh, yeah. I had. She yeah. showed up loaded and he like, you stupid. Hey, Ryan, I'm not trying to put hey, no, your no, business no, out there. Hey, I'm not trying to don't put your ass. Teal. 
T.O., bro. Doing that you know where I live at, nigga. I know where you live at, nigga. Pull up. T.O., but I, I just want to prove a point. Like, you is a dedicated father. Like, nigga, you should be the one who had that dedicated hat on, nigga. That nigga kid should be giving you that dedicated hat, nigga. Because you been having them kids ever since they was fucking born, nigga. They ain't been with their mama. They ain't seen their mama until you told them they could go with their mama and go when their mama call. Like, we going to keep it clean. Like, Ryan, I love you, dog. Ryan, you the king daddy in my fucking heart, nigga. I swear to God, nigga, you been having them kids ever since they was one, two, three years old, nigga. Shout out, man. Hey. All right, we going to get up out of here. Yeah, after that, man. We can't have my girl back here looking crazy. You got to chase shit. That's why you got to chase shit. Make sure it's good. You got to. You can't just be taking shit, doing shit over, overboard. That's what I said on New Year's. Just, just doing shit, just throwing shit. It could be because it catch up to you. You know what I'm okay. saying? It definitely, no, nah, you was just leaning over. We don't. We ain't doing that on a podcast, man. We're going to get up okay. out of here. We already been in here three hours and 18 minutes. Three so we're going to give her a pass. Three hours? Because she was in here doing it up now it's wearing down we in here three hours and 18 Love minutes like this fucking yeah. video right now <laughs> hey hey 2024 we, the we doing new things we doing new everything man we love y'all man support us we support y'all man dm us we gonna open it we gonna try our best to follow everybody we fuck with y'all back on fig you be up. yeah don't worry about nothing man we love y'all every monday and friday at 4 p.m hopefully we got some uh, good surprises for y'all next week man but any everybody that entered the giveaway, we definitely gonna give away y'all. Uh, we gonna we make we gonna make sure we ship y'all stuff. You know what I'm saying? We got your name, your address. Make sure you email that. Um, even if you don't get any of the giveaway stuff, this nigga crazy. Even if you don't get any of the giveaway stuff, you still can get a free tea by still um the. By still downloading the app, you feel For me? Sure. Depositing five, For using sure. our code, and then emailing the um e emailing the the picture of the uh code that you use. Right, and we I mean, got well, you. our code that you use. Emailing that, giving us proofs, we'll still send you a free tea. For sure. So make sure you sign up for that because that is coming every Monday and Friday, four p.m. You know what I'm saying? Back on Fig, we doing it. You know what I mean? My boy Smack, he said my nigga Cat William was back. smoking. Crack. Oh, my mama ain't doing shit. I ain't I'm putting it on the one way. <laughs> hey, on the one way. Hey, but make sure y'all watch us Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, man. Back on Fig. Fig Unity is on Wednesdays, man. We doing it up. We love y'all. I'm back, y'all. No matter what, I'm back. If my shit opened up on my foot, pause. I'm going to be here. I told y'all I was going to be here the first week, and I was there. Y'all didn't believe me. Y'all thought I was playing. Y'all thought yeah. I was play pimping. But Let's I'm here. Hey, haven't I been here back on Fig every Monday and Friday? Right or wrong? We gonna mm -hmm. keep it clean. Yeah. Haven't I been here though? We gonna keep it clean. Yep, knock this shit over, baby. He's We've been ready to go. I, I've been here, right? Yeah. Right, right. And and you I I called you, but I was calling you to ask you about a narrative. That's why I called you on that yeah. Wednesday. Yeah, but you yeah, tried to over. call me, I'm like, no, see you said No, I already had traffic. Traffic already was gonna bring me. That's what I'm saying. You, you lying. That's yo. okay. Your narrative it's is okay. No, your narrative. Ain't no my narrative is not crazy. That is your narrative. How you get here? Traffic. Get here? Oh. Bye. We going over here. Back up here. Monday and Friday, four o'clock. We going. Don't worry about nothing. Make sure y'all meet us on Monday. We up. You here.